Hello? Hello, hello? Hello? How we doing? How we doing? I guess you can you can tell that we're playing a different music today. <laughs> uh, and not just um, uh, the Baldur's Gate 3 soundtrack. I figured, you know, finally I have something else that I can play. Um, that won't get copyright copyrighted. Um, can anyone guess where, where the soundtrack is from? But hey, Ghost! Scoot is today's first, Ghost is today's third, thir third, or third as he likes to say. And Sparky Kitty Cat, hello, hello. That means that, you know, second is still up for grabs, so. <laughs> because for some reason, Ghost prefers to be third. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but I hope you're having a good Saturday so far. Hope you're having a good, a good day so far. Um, here it's been very, very chill, very quiet, very, very rainy. <laughs> so I, I don't know about you guys, but every time the weather's like this, I always get really drowsy, just lazy. Don't really feel like doing anything. <laughs> also, I don't know if... If you can hear any extra sound, it's because I, I have the window open, because Sirius, he's very... Uh, he's very upset about the weather, so I needed to open the window so he can sit in the window and look out. So, uh, he's sitting right here, you can't see him, but he, he is next to me in the window, and he's just... Yeah, he just needed the... The option to go outside, even though he doesn't go outside right now. <laughs> uh, but you're having a good Saturday, plus no work for you until the 27th. Oh, damn. A whole week off. That's that's good. Do you have any any plans? Do you, do you have anything you you, 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 you want to do? It's a vet because it's a scoot. It's a scoot. How you doing, scoot? Have you eaten today? Have you eaten yet? Because if not, then you need to. Uh, you're making food right now? Okay, good, good, good. I'm proud of you. You're doing the heckin' thing. You plan to hibernate? Hey, that that is a good plan, in my opinion. That That is a very good plan. Um, but yeah, so... Uh, today we're playing Near Replicant, which is usually what I play on Wednesdays. But seeing as I cancelled Wednesday stream because I wasn't feeling good... I did say that, oh, but I really want to play it this this week. I don't want to have to skip a whole week uh, not playing it. So yeah, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. So we're gonna play that today instead. You got food when you were out shopping earlier. You you doing all the things. I'm proud of you, Scoot. I'm proud of you. You're doing it. But yeah. Uh, so uh, seeing as no no one. <laughs> Guess the music. The music is from Eneva, which is uh, a game that got released on Wednesday. Uh, if you were like me, uh, you had been anticipating this game for a really, really long time. The second game by um, the same people who made um, ba -ba 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 Gris. That's the the, the game. Uh, so I played that, even though like I was sick on Wednesday. But I started feeling better later on, so I started playing Neva when Neva when it came out, and uh, I mean it's a. I would say that it's very short in the same way that Gris is. If you play that, um, so you could technically do it in one sitting. I did it in two, um, because I had to get it. No, I didn't have to get up early for work. No, I, it came out on Tuesday. Yeah, it came out, out on Tuesday because that's that's when I played it. <laughs> because I was like, but I didn't work on Thursday. But I had to, yeah, I had to, um, I had to stop playing. 
a little earlier than I than I wanted to because I, I had to get up early for work on Wednesday. So yeah, I finished it on Wednesday. Uh, I did 100% it as well because uh, I did that with Gris as well. Uh, it's it's not too difficult. Um, so and you, you if you know me, then you probably know that I I do love my achievements, <laughs> my in-game achievements. But yeah, I recommend it. I'm not gonna. I did have some. Uh, I did. I was disappointed in some way. Um, that kind of soured the experience a little bit for me. But overall, overall, I do. I, I did really, really enjoy it because it also has. It's beautiful. It has amazing music, as you can hear. And it also, like, the art style, the colors, everything, really pretty. And uh, it is a puzzle game. But it, this one also has combat. And Chris didn't have combat, but this one does. So it's kind of like with with Ori. It's like the first one, I mean, Ori, the first Ori game had combat, but not... It was more puzzle-based. But this one is like a, a little bit of a mix. You would never guess that theme song. I mean, it's it is also an indie game, so I know that not everyone is aware of the game. Uh, it's more, I feel like it's more people who are very into into indie games that have been anticipating the game and stuff as well. But yeah, I recommend it. I recommend it. I do think it's still on sale. Like if you you can get like a bundle with both games, both Gris and Neva. I do recommend playing Gris first though. Not that they're connected or anything, but it's just just to compare the two because they're also really really good games, both of them. And short. So, if you are a person who prefers to play short games that you can play in like one sitting, maybe two, you know. Cindra! What? Hello! 29? 29 months? What the heck? Happy 29 months, Cindra! Thank you so much! How you doing today? You tired? You, you you chillin' after having a week at work. Thank you. Thank you for the, the, the 29 months. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. You've been here for such a long time now. Oh, but yeah, the, the music is really, really good. And oh, there's some, there are more things that I also want to say uh, with the game. It, it, the, it does have combat. And the design of, of the enemies and some of the, like... I guess it does have boss fights, but it's more like the, it has more chase sequences, which you know that I hate, but at the same time in this game it kind of... I didn't mind too much. Um, yeah, the design of some of the enemies and stuff is... Ugh. It's just so satisfying to, to, to see how it's animated and stuff. I don't know. You just gotta... You just gotta... Gotta see for yourself. But a super slow and chill day. Perfect. Hey, that sounds like a perfect uh, Saturday to me as well. Hope you're doing well. I am doing well. I am doing well. I'm also very tired though because it's been... It's been raining all day. I mean, to be fair, it's been raining several days um so that adds to it you know the 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 tiredness sleepiness not pressuring into going back to it or anything but when are we going back to elden ring uh good question i don't know i don't know i take it however like i feel like it because the thing is i'm i'm kind of burnt out on on souls games i i don't really i don't know i just i want to enjoy it you know but 
right now. I can't really explain why, but I just it just suddenly hit me that, you know, I don't really want to do this at the moment. Even though I know it's really stupid because I was right at the last boss. <laughs> and there's still, like, the DLC and everything, which I also will get to at some point. I just... If I know myself well enough, I know that it will just click back into place again. But now is not that time. <laughs> right now is not that time. So I, I... I don't know. I don't know. But we'll see. We'll see. Um... I do want to get to the, the DLC as well before the, the year is over. Hopefully. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> um, no need to push it, jump back when you want to. I mean, that's my plan. It's like, I also feel a little bit bad because I know that, you know, I, I got the DLC gifted as well. So I'm like... <sighs> I know that, uh, like... I'm not gonna have to feel any pressure or anything uh, with that, but at the same time I do, because I, I that was the plan. Um, so I'm. So I guess no, I don't know. Well, yeah, we'll see. We'll see when it happens. It will happen when it happens, but it will happen. I can say that much. It will happen. <laughs> Because it's like I wouldn't I wouldn't start playing it off stream instead. Um So if I am when I am playing it, it will be on stream the first time anyway. Because it doesn't have anything to do with, with streaming or not streaming. Uh like because with some games I do feel like Ah, this works better off stream, this works better on stream and stuff, but this So this 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 one I I will definitely be playing on stream. I will I will say that much. Um, agree with Souls games. You're also taking a break from them. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes it it's needed. Sometimes you just want something chill. You know. There's nothing that feels like a bigger wall to climb than when you're not feeling like it. Than a Souls like <laughs> that's true. Also, hi Chris. <laughs> also, I. I, again, I know you are not gonna um, say anything to this, but I also felt really bad because I didn't give you a single shout out yesterday uh, while we were playing together. Um, and uh, so go follow Chris if you haven't. Do it, do it, do it right now. And those of you who are, well, I'm I'm pretty sure everyone knows by now. But yeah, we we usually play Monster Hunter on on Fridays. With with Lauren as well. That sentence was a disaster. Uh, no, I I totally understood what you meant. I didn't even think about it. <laughs> uh, I know you. I know you don't mind, but I still feel bad about it because it's like it's not intentional. So it's just because I am a scatterbrained. Uh, something. I was gonna say something bad, but then you would just say NSD. <laughs> so then, uh, I'm, but I am scatterbrained, so I'm, I'm gonna say that and nothing else. That's just facts. Um, who's this Chris guy? He sounds handsome. You should go check out, uh, check, check him out. See, now I, I can't speak either. <laughs> I roll a typo. But you didn't finish the DLC yet, you stopped midway. How, like, without spoiling, is it because you got to a difficult point, or did you just not feel like, like, you were in the mood for it? Because you said that you're taking a break from it. NSD, but I didn't say anything bad. I, I stopped myself before I did. <laughs> also, guys, uh, if you are a user of, of Twitter, uh... I did mention this briefly yesterday, but I do recommend checking out Blue Sky instead. I have moved over there. I do still have my Twitter though, just to like keep updates and stuff. On or like be like 
kept up to speed on on a lot of things that haven't like moved over to blue sky um but i do recommend moving over there instead um because the more people do uh, that do it the it's just better and it's also one other good thing is that it doesn't have elon musk <laughs> So if you do use Twitter, I highly recommend going going over there, making making that switch. Um, I also post when I go live there, in case you 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 wanna give a sneaky little follow. But even if you don't do that, I still recommend using Blue Sky over over Twitter. Like I made the, the account many 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 months ago, maybe like a year ago or something. I don't know. Um. But I didn't use it yet, because no one used it. So then it kind of defeats the purpose when it's just dead. But now it's not. Now it's... Everyone is moving over now. <laughs> Which is really nice, because that means that... You can actually use it for what it's supposed to be for. Hey, Ellie! Welcome in! Welcome in! Thank you so much for the rain! How's your stream? How's your stream? Hold on. Let me give you shouty outy. Oh, you're playing today. You're playing. You're wait. You're playing Baldur's Gate three. Is it? Is it the the Astarian Origin run, or is it a new one? Hold on. Let me give you the 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 other one as well. We have a fancy one as well. <laughs> Imagine that. Um. But hey, Keegan, and hi, Jem, and Ellie, and James, and Galactic, and Boom. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Uh, and Alan, welcome in as well. Thank you so much for the raid. If you are not following Ellie, go go check her out. We, we play a lot of um, similar games. Like some Souls games, some uh, RPGs. And uh, we're also both European. <laughs> Not that that is like <laughs> a huge uh, deal because, like, you know, a lot of people are European, you know. Um, but yeah, go go check out Ellie if you haven't already. And if you're new here, if you're new here, my name is Vepriko, so you call me Vep, Vepri. Uh, my pronouns are she, her. Uh, you can, uh, you know, if you if you join the, the the raid, you can. Well, you can leave if you want to, but you can also just <laughs> hang out, lurk, uh, or do after stream care. Do whatever you need to do. Um, that goes for both Ellie and anyone who came in with the raid. But yeah, so we, we are playing Near Replicants. I usually play this on Wednesdays, but I didn't stream on Wednesday this week, so I'm doing that today instead. Um, and it's my first playthrough, so let's... Uh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. I, I really enjoy this game. Mm. Imagine not copying <laughs> the message. <laughs> hey, it happens. It happens. But I hope you all are doing well. Hope you're doing well. And also, thank you so much for the follow, I forgot to say. We do have anonymous follows for those of you who just wanna quietly lurk and, and not like interact or engage, but just wanna wanna chill. You know? You were just doing a quick stream together with Jemmy. She's visiting you. You tried some co-op. Ooh, that's cool. Nice, nice. Ellie's great. You recommend? It's true. It's true. I also recommend. <laughs> I also recommend. Uh, just, just, just leave. No. <laughs> well, I mean, if you want to, I'm, I'm not saying. <laughs> I'm not saying you should, but I mean, I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna stop you. Uh, I mean, who, how could I? <laughs> uh, who can type? I. I don't know. I don't know her. Who's that? But hope you're doing well. I'm doing. I'm doing pretty okay. I'm doing pretty okay. Um, it's it's a very rainy Saturday, which means that you know my energy isn't all all there, but. Still doing, doing good. But how are you though, Ellie? How are you though? Unless I, I, or I, I feel like I already asked, but I'm not entirely sure if I didn't. And then at least I did now. 
Um, yeah, the the main problem with with uh, the rain and stuff is mostly because my cat Sirius he he's in the window, so you, you well you can't see him, but he's here. He he gets very cranky and complains a lot when it's raining outside because he wants to be outside. He loves being outside. Um, but he hates the rain. So then it's like, he wants me to stop the rain so he can move on with his life, you know? I, I wish I could, but I can't. But you good, just tired from all the walking today? Oh, wait, walking? Did, did you like do some sightseeing for, 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 uh, for Jim? Or with, not for, but with. <laughs> Uh, but that's that's at least at least it's the probably the good type of tired then. After having like a really long walk, you you always feel like you feel kind of good tired, you know. Well, at least I do. Jemmy and Keegan are there, so have been traveling a bit. Oh, both. Oh, that's cool. That sounds really nice. That sounds really nice. I also really want to try to do that next year to try uh, try to meet up with more people that I've met through stream and stuff. Because I feel like it's been a, a really long time since I did that. So it would be fun. It would be fun. There's so many people that I want to meet. Uh, the weather was nice too. Very aut aut autumnal. Um... <laughs> that reminds me of, of a of a talk we had uh, maybe a week or two ago where it was like autumny. I called it autumny, and then apparently that was new to some people. <laughs> but it's an actual word. It's an actual word. Um, World tour, that you know. I mean, if I had the funds, I would definitely do that. The only thing stopping me is is the money. I I love traveling. It's one of my favorite things. It's just too bad that it's so expensive that I can't actually do it very often. Autumny, yeah. <laughs> I didn't want to say any names because <laughs> no. But yeah, money is a pain in the ass. Money is a pain in the ass, but it's also really handy to to have. Um, unfortunately, yeah, I'm I'm currently playing the music from from Neva, by the way, uh, which is really really good. Uh, so I'm like I'm also like sometimes stopping. Oh, I remember where this was from because I haven't actually, I didn't actually listen to it before I started playing it on stream, uh, because I haven't really sat down and and listened to music these past few days since I played the game. Um, yeah, it's, it's, it's really, really good. The music and everything. Someone cancel money right now? Yeah. <laughs> good OST. Have you played it? Have you played Neva? It, it was, it was good. It was good. I also really like the design of the enemies. The, the way they kind of look like no face and stuff. Um... I don't think that that is a spoiler, because they kind of show up in the trailer too, right? Your days are numbered. <laughs> true, true. Not yet. I do, I do recommend playing it though. I, I would... I would say that Grace was probably a more solid game overall. In my opinion, but... Still very, very good. Um, and it's the it has like the same look to it as well, and and the music is by the same composer, Berlinist, I guess, is is the name. Um, so it has a lot of similarities, but it has combat though, which Gris didn't have. Um, so that's. That's like the main difference. That and you can also pet the the the, the wolf. You can pet the wolf. You know that, that that's 
That's always how a game should be. If there's a dog or a cat or any other animal that you're friends with or is friendly in, in a game, you should always be able to pet them. If not, it's a shitty game. <laughs> pet the wolf, best game, yeah! Neva is the name of the wolf. Um, in case, in case, like, I, I, I hadn't picked up on that before. But uh, apparently that was, like, obvious to everyone else. <laughs> pet the wolfle! Yeah, pet the wolfle! Actually, Neva is a pretty cute name. I like it, I like it. But yeah, let us open the game, let us open the game. we have just, just been sitting here chatting for a while now. I haven't been streaming for very long. Uh, ba -da -ba -da, ba -da -ba -da. I haven't changed the game capture either. Ah, what is it with the Japanese games and, and flashbangs? I'm just saying. There we go. For everyone's info, second is not taken yet. That's true. That is true. Second has not been taken today yet. Um, you used to call your brother Steven Nevo when you were a kid, so it makes you think of that every time. <laughs> is he? Does he look like a wolf too? Uh, got a lurk, shower, and sleep. Busy day tomorrow. Appreciate you. Have an amazing stream. Of course, Ellie. Go, go, do all the things and have a good night. And thank you so much for for the raid as well, guys. Go check out Ellie. Do it right now if you haven't. And she also. The the way that we we became acquainted was because we both enjoy K-pop as well. So. Um. Uh, we don't need to watch the cutscene. I feel like the cutscene is or the the it's kind of spoilery, and I don't want I want to get any spoilers. Um, easy, no assist. <laughs> it looks like you, but with, uh, but but wide. I was like, I thought you said W, like as in with, and then like with I'd. Oh, well, wide, I guess. <laughs> But yeah, thank you so much for the raid, Ellie. I hope you have a good, a good, good night and a good what? day tomorrow as well. <laughs> um, total play time is eighteen hours. So last time we meddled in some some relationship business. And we also went to a haunted mansion with a kid who can turn people to stone by looking at them. Uh, we also got the last... Uh... <sighs> What's it called again? The last thing we need to, to uh, get rid of the... The black scrawl of the sister, Viona. Yes, with Eid. <laughs> with with Eid, yeah. Ugh. This game is just so nice. I can't explain. It's just nice. Ah, koko desu ka? This is also a game that has very good music. It also has very memorable music too. It's like, it's not just some generic stuff that kind of blends into the background and you just never remember it again. It's, it, it to me at least, it feels memorable. Okay, let's see. What is our main objective now? The assist was invisible, that's why I didn't see it. Wait. This is a very nice tune. Mm. 
I did say that I was going to do like the fishing stuff off stream. I still haven't been able to do that because I was like, ah, uh, I I just don't want to waste a lot of time on, on fishing and, and side quest stuff on stream. But... I guess what I... Yeah, look around seafront for clues of the runaway's whereabouts. So this was like a son who had run away from... from home and he kind of tricked us into collecting stuff for him so that he could like distract us to get away and stuff <laughs> so now we have to look for him again i guess um No outsiders allowed, but I'm not an outsider. Well, I guess I am, kind of, but... Who are you to decide? You're a kid. You love fishing stream? <laughs> Honestly, games that don't have fishing in them... Like, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm not gonna say they're not playable because some of my favorite favorite games do not have fishing. Actually, I feel like most of my favorite games does not have fishing. I don't know why I felt like going in here because I don't think that there's anything to do. There's also no new dialogue either. But bustle, <laughs> B bustle sprouts. <laughs> but why are they so good? But so la labor intensive. I feel that. <laughs> Not the bustle sprouts. I. <laughs> Bussy sprouts? so oh, no. <laughs> um, I agree. I actually had Brussels sprouts on... What day was it? Was it Monday? Or was it last weekend? I'm not entirely sure. Is this a person we can talk to? Well, I mean, related to what we're supposed to talk about. Mama, Hey, you gotta help me out here. Just you just gotta. I'm having serious girl trouble. Oh, um, but do you see? I'm a I'm a, I'm a child. See, there's this girl that I'm pretty wild for, so I asked her out. But she won't even consider it unless I take her to a really nice restaurant. That seems rather demanding. That's true. Yeah. She really appreciates the finer things in life. First class places for first class ladies. She's so cool. Um, everyone has their own tastes, I guess. But what am I supposed to do about that? I tell you, there isn't another girl out there as high class as mine. Uh, we didn't even get a a quest? I, I don't know what the, the point was there, but... You love Brussels sprouts. Me too! I love it. But I was gonna say, it is a lot of work because... So many people say that they don't like it, but I think it's just because they haven't gotten them properly prepared before. Um, because to get good Brussels scr uh, sprouts, don't have them frozen. I mean... It, it, works i guess but it's just it's just not the best and 
you should peel them. You should peel off a few layers so it's not like... So it doesn't look dirty and, and all that. Like, because it has different coloring outside. So I think it makes them a little bit bitter. If you don't peel them. And then if you if you cut them in half, you don't have to boil them for that long. And it's easier to... to, to kind of know when they're ready and it doesn't take uh, as long and it's just better like it's easier to get them more evenly cooked um because they sometimes come come in a lot of different sizes too so it's like if you're not if you're not cutting them in half then some can be overcooked some can be okay and then some can be yeah it's just i don't know i personally prefer to steam them or Um, people must be having them cooked in the worst way to make them hate them. Or man, just trauma dumping on you. <laughs> Typical way, yeah. Well, you yeah, we aren't your therapists, it's true. You prefer oven roasted Brussels sprouts, but you do take some layers off and cut them in half. Mm. I haven't really tried it because I feel like, uh, as you said, it takes more effort. <laughs> but I do like to, to steam them in like, well, I, I don't know. Because it's not like steamed in that way, but it's also not boiled because it's just, I just have a little bit of water in the bottom of the... And, and, and then I just add some butter as well, so it's kind of steamed in water and a little bit of butter. And that makes them so good. And they need to be a little bit al dente, you know? I feel so weird saying that word because it's like... It sounds like I'm trying to... Like, I sound pretentious when I'm saying it, but it's just... It's just the, the, the best way to describe what I mean, you know? Spitting sprouty facts here. I was also kind of spitting a little bit, I feel. Uh, who am I looking for, though? Maybe I need to go to the... Um, to the pub. It's better than saying bitey. Wait, do people say that? But yeah, it's like they have a little bit of resistance uh, to them, as we say in in Norwegian, <laughs> which which also sounds really weird because it's like <laughs> sounds like they're fighting back. <laughs> it sounds like they're fighting back. <laughs> Which, you, you don't want Brussels sprouts that fight back. That's... But there was the, the fairy dude. The one that was gonna fix the, the boat. Stand your ground, Green Brothers, they can get us all. <laughs> Are you also a Green Brother? Hey, we're all green here. Let's see. Okay. Well, I have talked to you before, but I need to deliver right. stuff. So this is not the one that I need to talk to. I guess I'm just gonna leave town and do some other stuff. Because I don't know what clues I was supposed to look for. It usually gives you a prompt when there's someone you can talk to. 
but there haven't there there's not been a single person that isn't like a quest that I've already started. That is unrelated to what I'm trying to find. This is a secret place no one can find me. Well, except you, I guess. Now go away before more people come. <sighs> okay, fine. Be that way. Yeah, what's for dinner? Uh, yeah, except for Brussels sprouts. Or bustle sprouts. Um... What are you doing running around sneaking up on people? I don't... I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, let's just... Leave. I think I need to go back to... Oh, wait! I can talk to you? You're looking for a kid who ran away from... Away from home? <laughs> I needed to leave to find the what I was looking for in town. There was a strange kid asking people questions earlier. I think he was trying to learn how to get into facade. Facade, huh? Maybe we should go take a look. I guess so. 95%? Damn. Good work on that. That was a very, very strange uh, exchange of, of words between the two of you. Ow. Don't interrupt me! I have no time to stop. I'm just ignoring that one. It keeps respawning every time anyway. Internet dropped as you nip to the shop. Oh, you're wait, you're out right now. You don't have to apologize. He left us, he did. Scoot hates us now. You having a roast chicken dinner of sorts? Oh, sounds good. That sounds good. I also want roast chicken dinner of sorts. Um, <laughs> you have enough for, for us all? All school? 
Wait, this is not where I need to go. Uh, what did you get from the shop? A sexy pepper. <laughs> uh, I like how that's not gonna make sense to anyone who hasn't been in, in Discord. Uh, bottle of Iron Brew didn't buy the rabbit either. Oh. Well, I guess it's gonna be a boring Saturday for you. Oh, is this the fairy? <gasps> Wait, do we have the fairy now? Why are you showing me a whole cutscene of the t the town? Oh, it just teleported us back to our home. <laughs> Wait, what? Unfortunately, it intends to get copyrighted. <laughs> so there has been part of the in parts of the in-game music that has. Been marked as copyright on on YouTube. See, the thing is, I try to, to plant things, but there's always a time skip in certain quests that suddenly they're all dead by the time you get back to your house, and it's so annoying. <laughs> so I haven't actually been able to, to, like, harvest anything, because every time I try to plant something, it's just dead when I get back home. Bottle of Iron Brew. I still have never tried it before because they don't have it here. Well, I guess it, they, they probably do in like special shops and stuff, but no shops that I've ever seen. I guess it's the lack of fair use in Japan rearing its head. Yeah. Yeah. But it's not always though. It hasn't happened every single time. Let me just see if there is something with the fairy here. Wait, no, this is not the way. I guess I need to get, go go up here. It'll be expensive as hell, too. Wait, what do you mean? Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, can I use this now? <laughs> the fairy's out of service right now. But I, I did that quest last time to get the dude to fix the, the fairy. Oh, imported iron brew. I thought you meant the, the copyright stuff. <laughs> I'm like, uh, yeah, but they they would. I mean, I I don't know. Maybe they would sue people over it. I don't know. <laughs> Probably not. But you you never know. You also thought he meant the copyright stuff. <laughs> Send like a full week after we talked about it. No, no, no. It's <laughs> it was just because you said two things. I wasn't sure which one you meant. It wasn't because of how long it took. Because it, it didn't take long at all. Okay, let's go and talk to Popola. Just a mild rod sinning. Hey, we all have a tiny rods inside of us. Um, but, you know, not in a, not in a weird way. That poor girl. True. <laughs> what? <laughs> what do you mean? Don't make it weird. <laughs> okay, so we got this one last time. It's a sculpted leaf, right? Wait, no! Wait, what is this one? This is the first sane thing I've seen in this room. No, this is the one we fought last time. It was the book. I don't know what this leaf is. Look why, somebody made a copy of you. Nonsense. I'm nowhere near this filthy. <laughs> Saw this cube back in the barren temple. Perhaps the Prince of Facade gave it to Popola as a gift? Hmm. Because it said that we already had all of the um, sealed verses now that we needed. But I thought that we would need more. I also wonder how we're going to fill the entire uh, shelf. Ah, but yeah, I, I just love this music right here. It's so good. Popola, Yona's cough is getting worse. Well, that's not good. Any chance you could give me some more medicine, please? The thing is, I actually just ran out. I hate to ask this, but can you get me some more, uh, some vapor moss? Vapor moss? How, how does that work? You find it growing near the southern gate. Vapor moss, huh? I'll be right back. Also, I, I watched... Oh, I, I, no, I don't think that that's a spoiler because it's like, you know that they're connected even though they're like thousands of years apart. But it was so cool when I watched uh, the Nier Automata anime. And you saw um, a glimpse of this library. That was really cool. I was like, I know where that is. <laughs> um, give me a vape. No, giving her a vape. Ah, leave vapor's moss alone. <laughs> I'm trying. No, I'm actually not trying. Probably should try, 
but uh, it's 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 my moss. He grows that on his back for his own use. <laughs> like the moss swine, but it's just Is is vapor a moss swine? We have to go back then. Yeah, I really need to get the ferry going so I can get to an area that I can't access unless I use the... Um... Unless I use a boat. About. Oh! There it is. Obtain vapor moss. What? A meal? Why are you huffing? You're supposed to be in the manor. For those of you who don't know, last time when we went to the... Well, I keep calling it the haunted manor, even though it's not actually haunted. Well, I guess, in a way, it kind of is. Um... Emil is the, the boy who, who could, like, petrify people with his, with his uh, eyes. So he had to have a blindfold on. Otherwise, everyone would turn to... Um, to stone. So... You could- I think you could see, like, either the staff or his family or something being petrified. Outside, so he only lived there with a, a butler. Or I guess two butlers, but they're, like, androids. So they're not even human. Actually, I don't even know if e uh, Emil is, is human. That's the thing. That's what I don't know about this game yet. It's like, I don't know who's human and who's an- who's android. Uh... Yet. You managed to overdo it today and now your leg hurts? Wait, what have you been doing? Have you been now, um, like, running or jogging or something? <laughs> it's so funny. Well, let me take a picture of Sirius. I think he's fallen asleep in the open window. He's such a weirdo. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna post it in the Discord. <laughs> it looks so funny. Uh, seeing as we're having an odd break anyway, I'm just do doing that now. Just a long walk to all the car dealerships. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You were doing that today. Oh, well, he's not being a derp. It just, it's just... He's <laughs> just... He's just a silly little, little guy. You know? Just a silly little guy. A little, little patat. Yeah, he looks like he looks like a little patat. <laughs> uh, he's 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 so cute. He's a cutie. They're such weirdos. It's delightful. It is. It is. Oh, I love cats. <laughs> it's like he gets the both like the best of both now because he wants to be outside. But now he doesn't have to worry about getting wet, so he's just 
sleeping in the open window. Yeah, we're back from the ants. <gasps> oh no! That's funny, they say it in the same way that we say uh, Emil in Norwegian. We say Emil. Well, it's more similar to the Norwegian way than the English way, I guess. But he's collapsed. What are you up to? What is it? What happened? What's going on? Hmm. Oh. He doesn't seem to be sick. I think it's just fatigue. I can't imagine how hard it must have been to run all this way without sight. Hmm. Are you alright, Emil? I can see it. Hey, just take it easy, okay? The air is vibrating. I can feel it behind my eyes. So much pressure. Oh god, there's so many of them. Get out. Get out of the village. The shades are coming. Oh no, the shades are gonna take over the village? Already? But I wasn't done with stuff in the town. It sounds like they're already here. Come on, let's go. What's going on? I guess we'll find out. And I just went to get the herbs. Oh! That was a new... ...loading screen. Like the pages were black instead of white. The shades are attacking. God damn it. Oh no, they're gonna kill everyone? The hell is going on? No time, get everyone into the library. And please, make sure Yona's safe. Don't worry, I'll grab her. Just don't get yourself killed, alright? I won't. Now go, Devola. Hurry. Or De Devola, I guess. A new one. Is that the grand grandpa? Because we already fought the grandma, but oh no, it's the attack on Titan now.
The walls can't keep them out. Ow. I can't see shit. I'm just not sure where I'm supposed to, like, oh. Walk on to you. The camera is very difficult to navigate. <laughs> uh, like, I'm not trying. Wait, what? Uh, I wasn't locked on at all. Another handshake. Well, that's a pretty rough handshake. That's a lot of blood. Literally just uh, thinking about making an attack on Titan comment. <laughs> uh, you're not really looking for anything in particular, just a car you're currently interested in. Mazda 2 you've seen? Hmm. Might not end up getting it, but you'll see. You're still backing a smart car? You'll drive a smart car if you pay for it. <laughs> Yeah, you feel like they're putting themselves at a disadvantage by getting up on the buildings like this. I agree, because, you know, there's not a lot of advantages that they could give us, but they give us the few ones that... ...that we can get. You drive anything if someone else is paying for it? Oh. Do we have to stop it from leaving? Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true. I'm 
toward you. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Wait, so it grew its arm back again? my chance can you guys stop it I was like why do I have to fight you guys as well it's just I have different things to do here that are more important Oh shit. Is it drawn to all the people, maybe? one foot yeah rip it off hey sleeves Close the window when he jumped down from the from it, and now he's back and he's probably annoyed that I closed the window. <laughs> hey, it's kinda that that should help. Is that your grandpa? We already helped her kill her grandma once. <laughs> Trying to be shakel time. Another to time, I'll be so. Ow, I, I meant to jump. I forgot. I forgot to jump that time. <laughs> As well. No? There would be like a cutscene thing when I did that as well. No? There we go. So where do I need to hit then? The head? The face? Probably. Yeah, 
Yes. I saw you in chat and <laughs> What are you doing? Oh shit. Hold on. Thank you so much for the raid. I can't pause the cutscene. Unfortunately, I tried, but it just let me it lets me skip, but I can't pause it. Um just give me give me a A minute. Hmm. Hey. Sirius join, join joining the raid too. Oh no, shades in the library. <gasps> Not the shades in the library! <gasps> Thank you so much, Vox, for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. What were you doing? What were you up to today? You were playing Stardew Valley? Is it your first time playing? Stardew Valley is pretty chill. I hope you're enjoying it. I hope you're enjoying it. And also, thank you so much again. And go check out Vox if you haven't already. Um, Good people. Funny people as well. <laughs> um, but yeah, if you're new here, uh, my name is Veprikos. I'm a Norwegian streamer. I You can call me Vep. Uh, Vepri. A lot of people don't know that, so they say my entire name. So I was like, um, you don't have to do that. <laughs> you can call me Vep or Vepri. Uh, whatever. But yeah, I'm um, I'm currently playing uh, but a, but a, uh, Near Replicant. The first time that I'm playing it. Uh, I have never played it before. Um... So, yeah, I'm having a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun because I, I'm really enjoying it. I usually play this on Wednesdays, but seeing as I didn't stream on Wednesday, I really wanted to play it uh, at least once this week. So that's why we're doing it on a Saturday instead. But yeah, yeah, so that's what we're doing. But yeah, if you need to, if you need to raid and run box, uh, obviously, if you, oh, I can't talk. <laughs> Feel free to do that. Uh, but you can also hang out and chill if you want to as well. Um, <laughs> Vaj Vajingo? Vajingo. The Vajankle, Chris's favorite thing. <laughs> uh, prepare your butts and prepare your eyes for Vox's degenerates de have arrived. Dude, th that's perfect though, because you know, we have been known to be legions in this chat as well. Especially on Fridays when I'm playing Monster Hunter with Chris and Lauren. <laughs> Uh, you enjoyed this cutscene. This is one of your favorite games. It is. Did you play it when it when it came out, or um, like did you play when you were like the father instead of the brother, or did you play this one? Because I feel like a lot of a lot of people have said that they prefer to pr prefer the game when you play as the father instead. Um, but I'm really enjoying this one though. Vox is a big Nier fan. Oh, I see, I see. You power gaming a new farm in 1.6 and successfully accumulated 1 milli vanilli gold before the end of the year with level 10 in your skills. Damn. Damn. Well, that that is pretty impressive. I'm pretty impressive. I have not played the game at all since the, the big update, um, but I've heard a lot of good things. Yeah, the the weeb command is just my my uh, my anime list and analyst profiles. <laughs> in case in case you too enjoy the animus and the mangas, and uh, you like to keep track of everything you watch and stuff, and you can you can add me as a friend if you want to. You also use them. This isn't my entire name though. I thought it was Veprikos, the Green Queen of the Fox, Defender of the Northern Land, Servant of the Floofs the Third. Y you're right, but there's a shorter, shorter version of the name. 
Us Degens? Never, never, never. Um, yeah, there was a lot of, a lot of Degen talk yesterday in, in, like, specifically yesterday. Don't recall any Degen behavior, keep it clean here. If you want clean, uh, you have to go to Rod's stream and then make it unclean. <laughs> I didn't play the OG near, but you played Automata and then scooped this up as soon as it dropped on Steam and loved it. Mm. I see, I see. So, did you do you prefer Automata or this one? Because I have never heard of anyone who prefers uh, Replicant over Automata. So I'm I'm just curious if 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 you feel the same way or if you feel differently. Degen disgust. Wait, no, no. You want to go back and play the Dragon Guard series and pick up all the additional books? Hmm. You should. You should. I have not played any of them, but I also haven't seen any anything played uh, of of those games either. <sighs> but uh, I, I'm getting more and more. Series found something to play with. Um. I'm enjoying the series more and more now. Chris is 99% proud. <laughs> That's rigged. That's rigged. <laughs> Won't do it anymore. No flap. No, Chris, stop it. <laughs> stop it. Uh, I think Automata had a lot of quality of life improvements and is a much more expensive game. But do you think Replicant holds its own in terms of story and the OG lore? Mm. 100? Holy crap! This this bot is giving some big big numbers today. That's that's the ultimate. <laughs> um. <laughs> hey, see silence or is it silence? How how? Oh, is it silence? Is it just a, a fancy way of saying silence? It's yeah, I needed to say it out loud to to get it. <laughs> but welcome in, welcome in. Uh, yes, like silence. Damn, I'm good. No, I'm <laughs> but welcome in, welcome in. <laughs> it's encrusted with the remnants of Evil and Def No, don't, no, no. <laughs> I need to stop reading messages out loud the first time that I read them. Um, but also, thank you so much for the follow. I, I missed the, 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 that there was a follow as well earlier. Uh, I was a little bit, uh, in, in, in the, in the middle of the cutscene. But yeah, we also have anonymous follows, by the way, for those of you who, uh, who are just lurking, you know, and want to stay lurking. Um. <laughs> hey, but the head pad is for you, Vox. So don't leave before I give the head pad. There we go. There we go. There we go. Feel like a good egg? You're a good egg. <laughs> but yeah, I... So, I've said this quite a few times already. I have tried playing Near Automata twice. Uh, last time was on stream. I have not managed to get past the first five hours because... Well... It's very gray. The game is very gray. And you don't really feel like you, you care about anything going on at the beginning. That's why I feel like it's different with this game. For me, I feel like it's a bit important for me to play this game. And not just go straight to Automata, which I've heard a lot of times now recently after I started playing this game. That apparently... A lot of people tell others to just skip this game and go straight to Automata. For me, that was not the way to go. Because I like I feel like I'm more interested in playing Automata now after I played this. Well, I'm still not done with this play uh, this 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 game, but I could not get into it. Um because it just I feel like it has a slower burn, but with this one, you feel like you care from the beginning about characters and, and the story. So... 
Yeah, I feel like I needed to... I have... I have needed to play this one first. And then play Automata later, because now I want to. I didn't want to before. I didn't... I didn't feel like there was any... Anything driving me to play Automata at all. And now you must go prepare... find beef dinner? Wait, but it's so late. But yeah, enjoy your dinner, though. Enjoy your dinner. I mean, I shouldn't speak, because I also eat dinner quite late, but... Hey, K-Pig Network, <laughs> welcome in, <laughs> welcome in. You have to try this game. Automata was dope. Yeah, uh, I would definitely... If you enjoyed Automata, uh... But if you enjoyed it mostly for, like, I mean... The combat is different. A little bit different. But if you enjoy the story and the lore of these games, I think uh, I would definitely recommend playing this game as well. I prefer the combat in this game than I played. Like, I didn't really care for the combat that I got to experience in Automata. But I like the combat better in this one. The lore you get from playing this game that ties to Automata is truly incredible. Hmm. You loved it? You played it three times? Yeah, you should definitely play this one then. Um, if you already enjoy the the story and stuff, um, would definitely recommend that. Oh yeah, we need to go in, in into the library. You haven't seen much of this game just yet? That's fair. Yeah, I feel like not a lot of people have been talking about it. Oh, he's here! Emil! Also, yes, I am playing on easy because I just want to play the game for the story. I usually don't play any games on easy, but... <laughs> Let's take care of these shit hogs. Did he just say that? <laughs> oh, this game is funny. I love Kaina as well because she she is hilarious. Oh no. Wait. Okay, so the head is still alive and tentacled. Ah. I, I mean to stay on one at a time. No! It, the the lock-on is, is kind of difficult to control sometimes. <laughs> because I meant to keep to one. This one stayed longer though. Before it reset. The basement? Yes. I love basements. <laughs> Wait. So where the fuck is the basement? Oh, 
Also, I don't know if I'm supposed to do that or if I'm supposed to just get it the health down first. <laughs> Wait, no, shit. I I, 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 got, I got a little bit distracted there. <laughs> Black cats. <laughs> uh, thank you, Black cats. <laughs> I was, I was like, what is going on? This does not sound like the game music. Um, <laughs> how you doing, Black Cats? But overall, having a dope day so far. Doing pretty good. It's doing, uh, it's, it's, it's pretty good. I hope you're having a, a great day as well. Piggy plays Uno reverse card. <laughs> I have one too. Well, no, it's not a card. It's just, I just, I just have a no you. They're welcome to hog the shit you don't want. <laughs> uh, sorry. No, it's okay, Black Cats. It's okay. <laughs> you have this for tiny. <laughs> no! No! Black Cats, don't, don't apologize. Um... Okay, so we we need to do that again. Can you stop? I'm trying to be locked on, but it doesn't actually stay locked on. Uh. Hey. That was no time. What do you mean? Also, when you say knock down to the basement, where the fuck is the basement? Because this this is not open. Stop with the spin to win, okay? Because you're not winning. I'm just taking a little bit longer to, to make you not win. Dude, can you... The lock-on is not doing a very good job right now. There we go. Punch him. Into the basement, whatever, wherever that is. I mean, it's down somewhere. There we go. No, don't take her. Wait. But that's someone who's been slightly petrified.
No, we're about to cure her. They're bowing to us. Mm. So that's where the grimoire lies. No, noir is. しぶりだな。白の所有。誰だ、貴様は。我は黒の所有。前自身だ。うん。何だと白の所有。まだ思い出さぬか。我らの真の目的を。夜な。寝たらめを言うてない。よほど思い出したくないらしいな。誰かを傷つけてしまうからか。そんなこと馬鹿馬鹿しい。我らは魔王のために作られし書物。あの方以外を向く心など生まれるはずもない。魔王。思い出せ。我らが目的を。I can't pause the cutscene. <laughs> Oh no, not the merge. Yeah, listen to her. <laughs> I love her. She is so. Uh, she is the best. <laughs> <笑>我らは逃亡された<笑> でも僕は忘れませんから何があったって忘れないシロさんがシロさんであることはあ、もう、ウィガンルーズ I feel like that's important lore for later. おい、白を止めろ。このままだとあの黒いやつに白が取り込まれるぞ。黒い白、黒い。そうだ。そのまま我と一つになるのだ。
Hmm. This can't be good. <laughs> this can't be good. Don't carry the sword with that arm. サイゾ。白白と気安く呼ぶな。我が名は白の書だ。白さん、白。かいね。お前は土作さに紛れて役立たずの崩れだ言いたい方でやったな。構造。また会えたな。白。大丈夫なのその質問そっくりそのままお前
I could never. <laughs> um, but hitless too? Yeah, that that is that is pretty hardcore. Not pretty hardcore. Unless it's an online competitive game, you should be able to pause at any time. You will die on this hill. I fully agree. I fully agree. Also, let me give you a shout out to Yaudi as well. Um, Mm. Go go give go give millennial engineer a follow as well. You can never bloodborne as hard as fuck. <laughs> true, true. But yeah, uh, Cody is is really good at, at at Souls games, and it was it was really fun because we were playing Eliza P when it came out at the same time. So it was like each time I streamed, he was like a little bit behind or ahead of me and then it was like we were just kind of like switching between being ahead and being behind of each other <laughs> so it was pretty fun um bloodborne is your favorite souls game i bloodborne i have never played bloodborne myself because i watched so many people play it um before i got the chance to it well i mean i could still do it but I don't know about you, but for me, it's kind of important to go into a, bl a game blindly. Uh, I, I don't really like knowing anything or like knowing as little as possible before playing a game. Um, but I love the lore. I absolutely love the the Bloodborne lore. It's the best. It has the best lore out of all the all the FromSoft games, in my opinion. Mm. So, I do enjoy that. I do enjoy that. But yeah, now we're gonna get into another fight, I guess. <laughs> and all my, my magical powers are gone. All oh, too, too. I mean, the, I mean, it's fine. We have been doing melee damage quite a bit. <laughs> I don't bother with the the pairing here because it's it takes too long. So I'd rather just dash away from them. I I never thought that I would say that because I prefer pairing <laughs> in general in in games over just dodging, but. It's just- it just takes too long. It's fine if you fight against one at a time. But if it's two pe- uh, two- I was gonna say people, but it- not exactly people. Can I even hit that? I don't know if I can. stuck in here. Okay, now I can do that. Okay. We can now use Dark Blast. <laughs> Chris, no. <laughs> I love, I love parrying, okay? I love it. Okay, 
Let me just heal up a little bit. Ah, fuck off. But yeah, so when it comes to these games, because of what I... How I felt about Automata, because... I couldn't really get into it. That's why I decided that, you know, I want to play this for the story. So I'm playing on easy, so... That's why I'm like, I'm, I'm kind of whatever with the heals and everything, because <laughs> I'm playing on easy. I, I only care about the story. I, I don't really care about the challenge or anything in this game. I got all my powers back, but at the same time, I'm just <laughs> using melee anyway. <laughs> Oh fuck, it's this part. Okay. Ow. Wait. I didn't I didn't equip that. Hold on. Let me switch that because I don't want that one. I prefer to have the I prefer to have the dark lance. Rude. Okay, I focused on attacking there. I shouldn't have done that. It's fine. It's fine. Why do you do that? He's a book. Yeah, don't take her. Isure ni se o, ware ware no te ni modoru koto ni naru no da, subete ga. No! Okay, 
no but not like this. Well, that's a cruel choice. What the fuck? You can't just ask me to... Also, we're getting an ad. I'm so sorry. I'm not gonna make the choice during the ad. Just saying. I'm gonna wait until after the ad. Like, you can't make me do that. But it's like, at least you, you're letting me know that if I don't do it, then we will just be annihilated. So it's like, you're actually telling me? If you just said, do nothing... I think I would have been even more torn. But like, it's already telling you what will happen if you don't do anything. I'm wondering if... Okay, so... Said was talking about how if you get different endings, like you can you can play the game to get different endings and stuff, and then you don't have to start from the beginning to get the other endings. And he said that he was like from a specific point. And I'm wondering if this is the point where you start from, maybe. Don't answer that though. I'm just saying. I'm just thinking out loud. Because if you just say do nothing, then that has to be the end, you know? But like a bad end, obviously. <laughs> um, so I'm wondering what I should do. Well, I mean, I feel like... I have to choose the first one, though, but it's just... It's sad, because I really like Kaina. I feel like... They could- there should be a better way. <laughs> and also, you know, there- everyone is- is just badly hurt at this point. Like, can you even get away? Like, we are bleeding out, and then you have e Emil, who is just crawling around because he got attacked. So he can't move much either. But hey, Sodan, how you doing? Definitely the best team ever. <laughs> how you doing? We, we're facing a pretty difficult choice here now. And yeah, we're back from the ads, and I did say, if you got ads, then you probably heard, didn't hear me say that I'm not gonna make the choice during the ad break. So don't, don't worry, I haven't made a choice. I'm just... I don't wanna make the choice. <laughs> this is not a choice I wanna make. <sighs> this is this is not a choice I want to make, you know. Uh, but I feel like I don't. Like from what I've heard in 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 Automata, you have a lot of different endings, a lot of like small variations of endings too. Some are very silly, as well. And I'm just thinking that do nothing and be annihilated is just one of the endings, but it's obviously a really, really bad ending. But I don't want to end the game like that. <laughs> I've also been like thinking, you know, I kind of want to get all the endings on stream, maybe. What choice you don't want? This one on screen. 
have, I have a choice here. Be good, just came back from a shoot. Turned out so good. Nice, nice. <sighs> so yeah, none of them are good. No, no, no choice here is good. No, I, I, I know what I have to do. I just don't want to do it. <laughs> yeah, I guess we, we have to... We have to choose Petrify Kaina and seal away the shade. It doesn't seem like there's any other choice here, unfortunately. So I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. He could have just petrified the door? <laughs> what the fuck? You could have just petrified the door? You didn't have to petrify her? What do you mean? <laughs> well, I guess she kind of works like um, a seal in the middle there. But that's so sad. She was the best character. <laughs> she was the best character out of all of them. Ugh. Sure. I'm gonna make a new save, though. Damn, it's been over an hour since I saved. I should have... If I had known... It kind of just threw you into all of this. Uh, I didn't think that all of this would happen, so I didn't have a chance to save. So I don't know when that save is from. If it was like a manual one, or if it was... I don't know. She was so good, that's so sad. I know, she's so f she was so funny. But yeah, you see, this started happening when the whole fight here began. Five years later? <gasps> oh no, they gotten armors. Oh no, we became hot. <laughs> you may now use two-handed swords and spears. But we still have we still have wise though, so we can <laughs> level up from point of 
That's that's how you know you made it, Chris. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh Another one here, Kira. Oh, Stop calling me out! Jesus Christ! <laughs> uh, I was I was kind of worried about this because I've seen uh, I've seen the, the the haircut changed at some point, but I didn't see like anything specific about. I didn't know he would get older and stuff. But yeah. It is true, unfortunately. The, there is just something about white-haired, um, fictional, specifically, uh, mostly anime characters. Um, <laughs> I can't help it. Uh, I wasn't quite prepared for that, but, you know, I'm not complaining. Okay, as so I was supposed to change... Transcience or transience, I guess. Transience. He needs to be a bit of a bastard before I will consider. No, that's that's not true. That's that's actually not true, Chris. It's not because we also have Gojo. I mean, he can he be he can be not necessarily a bastard, but he can be. He can be a little bit of a shithead, uh, but he's he's not a bastard. So I guess I guess he's like an exception here. Gojo not being a, well, you know what I mean. <laughs> he's not like he's not bad. Like he's still considered like a somewhat good person, you know. Even though he's like. He's like a chaotic neutral. Well, I mean that's that's also a story. <laughs> he's like a no. He's chaotic good. No, he's like he's like chaotic neutral, chaotic good. It's like it's kind of difficult to say, you know. And people pointing out white-haired characters. <laughs> uh. Do not point out the obvious. There's your white haired and Georgian skin. <laughs> why? Why do you guys know me so long? <laughs> I'm sweating right now. <laughs> uh, is Gojo just Kaisen? Yes, yes, yes. He's like the character that people consider to be from Jujutsu Kaisen. And he's like the most- he's probably like the most popular uh, character that people thirst for. Let's be real. Um, if I- <laughs> Hydrate? Okay, yeah, that's true. Uh, why are you like this? Why am I like this? I don't know. Okay, let's try this one. See, no, wait, I, I didn't switch. Okay, this is... This might be something for, for Chris, because this this feels like it... It has, like, the, the, the slow... Well, it doesn't have stamina, though. But it's like... Dude, I'm just trying to live here. No, I'm I just I'm just trying to practice here. I wanna see what they how they work. I'm not trying to block or parry here at the moment. Oh look at that. Oh Okay, let me check out. This was what I had before, I think. I kind of like the spear, though. The 
combos are really fun. Just loves a white-haired guy swinging his chin with no <laughs> Sorry, well, why you like this? Yeah, I, I know. Hey, at least I'm self-aware, okay? Okay, let me try the, um... Kusanagi. <clears throat> Wait, hold on, let me... There we go. Ow! Can't move that way. <sighs> okay, fine. I'll I'll start parrying then. It probably sounds like I don't like parrying, but it, I do. I just prefer to not have to do it when I'm fighting this many at the same time. Need to get used to this. I'm not used to this. Heavy weapons is also not my thing. Or are not my thing. I didn't actually mean to jump there. Oh, I can switch that quickly. Okay, good. Yeah, this is this is more my thing. You love a good spin to win, as long as it's not my enemies. Yes. He's hot. <laughs> Black ass. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. <laughs> I love, yeah, th this is also something that I haven't pointed out before. Well, I, I guess I've seen it and said it maybe once. That's also a cool thing with Tanji. You can make your own memes. Wait, we also have a, a command. No, not a command, but a quote that says something about we we make our own memes. You know, <laughs> black cats just just prove that. I should use that uh, dash more. <laughs> 
<laughs> but thank you so much, Black Cats. That's actually amazing. <laughs> Uh, are you hearing this right now? <laughs> but I, 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 I enjoy it. Okay. <laughs> but thank you, black cats. <laughs> uh, that one's for chat. Mm. <laughs> yeah, ten G is pretty great. See, we don't need blurp. We don't need blurp. 10G is better. Thank you, Blackheads. Yet another poor victim. All is stop. Hmm. You saw that one the other day and was just waiting very pa impatiently, might add, to find a time to use it. <laughs> uh, you found the perfect time, Black Hats. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. <laughs> it's dangerous here. You shouldn't get back. I don't- I don't think he's getting up. I'm sorry. Goddamn shades are even attacking the village now. An armored one's no less. This village of yours seems to be ch changing for the worse. It's all the Shadow Lord's fault. The one day, that one day changed everything. もう5年か。妹の夜が連れ去られてから5年。魔王を探し続けているが今だ足取りがつかめないままだ。5年の間に世界は荒廃し、国民病で死ぬ人々も増えてきた。そして俺は魔物を狩り続ける日々を過ご
Ah, uh, no. That's, uh, well, see, I'm not used to using a spear. I didn't know that I would fall down by using <laughs> one attack. Uh. Honestly, I do... No, I'm not gonna say that because people are gonna... Make it into something that it's not. <laughs> Can I use the boat now? Is that possible? I can just fish here? Well, let's try fishing then. I actually forgot how to fish in this game. I guess I guess I didn't. <laughs> that was a carp? Okay. That was a tiny carp. Um you can fish? Yes you can. Say the thing. <laughs> well, <sighs> Love this game, fish against Mondo <laughs> No, I was gonna, I was gonna say. Uh, well, seeing as I already pointed it out, no one has to point it out for me, you know. Uh, I was gonna say, I, I love. <laughs> no, I can't say it now. I feel weird. Uh, <laughs> now I feel weird. Um. Yeah, let's just go back to Popola. <laughs> I wonder if the old lady is still alive. She is. Has she gone older? Wherever her mind is gone is a happier world than this. Um, I, that's probably very true. Let me just save. A fishing stream, yeah. <laughs> uh, let me see what what the house looks like now. Oh. Gold moonflower seed. Nine thousand? Feel confident the child still lives. Of course she does. Of course she does. But hey, Kaina also had... She also had the black scroll. But I wonder how long she had it. Chicken egg. Wait, but there wasn't a rooftop. I wonder what that looks like now. Oh no, we're gonna see Kaina now. They haven't even bothered to clean the floor of rubble? It's been five years. What do you... What? Uh, do you still have your mount? Well, I mean, it's technically not a... Uh, it's just wild boars just lying around on the ground. <laughs> and then you just <laughs> casually mount. <laughs> So, uh, they should probably still be there, I would assume. Well, 
Wait, hold on. Let me see. I was wondering if it, if it was, like, impossible to interact with it. It's a council of ends. They're still deciding what to do about the mess. Hmm. Now I'm starting to wonder if... <sighs> what would have happened if I didn't do that? If there was a way to save her and everyone else, too. I don't know if I did the right thing. Look at you, I think you're grown even taller. Yeah, it's hard for me to tell anymore. But you haven't changed a bit, Popola. What's your secret? She's an android. Probably. I see your flattery skills are improving as well. No, it's true. You look the same as the day I first met you. Okay, now you're just embarrassing me. Anyway, here. This is from Emil. Hi, Vep. It's me, Emil. Sorry, I've been quiet for so long. Are you and Wise getting along alright? Is he still using big words and making everyone feel dumb? I bet he is. Anyway, I recently stumbled upon some records that might help us in cur curing Kaina's petrification. <gasps> Ooh, would you mind coming here to take a look? Thanks, I'll be waiting. Well, well. Perhaps the time has come to save Kaina. I take it this means you'll be leaving the village. Well, not for good, probably. Sorry, I know the shades have been rough lately. It's okay. Go, just be careful. <clears throat> should you take a nap? Yes, you should. Always, whenever in, when, when in doubt, always go for a nap. A nap is always advisable. Mm. Very important. Hmm. Important question. You know, just complain that you broke down and got fast food yesterday. You're still really not feeling well, so you don't you feel like cooking. So Rob suggested this new wing place that opened downtown. Should you get wings or you have personal pizzas and you've been craving a spicy and they have a buffalo chicken pizza, which should you I I would go with the pizza personally but that's because i'm always in favor of pizza but <laughs> especially if it i don't know these days i i always go for a type of pizza that is like barbecue chicken it's so good um so it sounds close enough so yes i would definitely go for that Hey, you have a quest? Uh, oh man, I'm in a heap of trouble now. What's the problem? I was distracted while I was cooking and sort of started a fire. <clears throat> now I have to repair the kitchen and all my equipment. Can't make the repairs without a bunch of parts. But the only place you can find that much scrap is in the junk heap. Yeah, that's bad news. All right. Oh, that's bad news. All right. Want me to go for you? Yeah, we're still the errand boy, I guess. <clears throat> uh, the only issue is you're very particular about buffalo chicken pizza. So far, you've not been able to find one that compares to a place that's back in Pittsburgh. But this could be it. Who knows? You never know until you try. And as long as you you like. Even if it's not going to be as good, it's probably going to be good anyway. So it's like, because pizza is, you can never really go wrong with pizza, you know? We've talked about this before. Even bad pizza, pizza is tastes good. Because there's actually no such thing as bad pizza. Unless it's like, gone bad. But that's, that's a whole different thing. But like, pizza is always good. Even the bad ones. 
So it's it's gonna be a win-win no matter what. <laughs> Treat this as an adventure then, who knows what will happen? It might be about the journey. <laughs> about the journey of, of, of tasting new, new pizza. Or just get both. That is also an option. This seems like an, a unanimous decision. Hmm. For once we are all agreeing. And, and for once pizza is not splitting us in half. Pizza brought us all together again. You sure? You'll have to bring a whole bunch of robots and take it from them, so it ain't exactly safe. Contract for a contractor. Hmm. All the more reason to entrust the task to us. This won't be our first time in the junk heap. Just let us know what you need. Look at the pigs! Thanks, I really appreciate this. I need one memory alloy, ten titanium alloys, and ten broken motors. Got all of that? Wow, that's a lot. But okay. We'll be back in a while. We'll be back in a while. But if you hate it, Black Cats, it's not our fault. But how can you hate a pizza, though? That seems impossible to me. In fact, if you do, you could share with all of us so we can hate the pizza, too. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> let's 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 share the hate. Hey, you haven't seen any thieves around, have you? A bunch of sticky fingered bastards that keep taking my merchandise. No, first I've heard of it. They don't take a lot, but they when they strike, it's always food, and in some ways, that's our most precious commodity. Thieves and trading. Do you have a plan or are we going to walk up to every person we see and shake them until stolen vegetable fall from their pockets? I mean, that's an option. Let's try asking around the village. Thieves in the village, I can't believe it. One could call it a sign of the times. True. Rare is the man who steals out of choice as opposed to need. That's very true. We've been dealing with a wave of robberies lately. Better keep a close eye on your purse. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, Bakinawi? Wait, what do you what do you mean? They won't be like, why the fuck did you pick this black ass? This sucks. <laughs> and then try the pizza again just to confirm. Ah, just the person I wanted to see. Do you have a moment? What's up? Our water wheel is on its last legs. But water wheels don't have legs. They have spokes. I like to shore it up, but the job is a little beyond my skill set. This is a wise thought on your part. Now we have a machine of not, not insignificant age. Better to repair it now than wait until it fails completely. Suppose we'd all be in trouble if it broke. So what do we need? Replacing the axle and the paddle board should be su suffice for now. I believe the strange thing story in the facade should have everything we need. Sure. Alright, we'll head there when we have a minute. Thank you. And while you're gone, I'll track down someone who to do the actual repair work. Uh, no, no, no. I, I knew that you were talking about the it's been a while thing, but it's like I didn't. Bakinawi? Uh, I, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I still don't get it. <laughs> Even if you explain it to me, I still don't get it. <laughs> Maybe it's the can- wait, um, you should think that too, but there's a place downtown that is frequently- frequent- frequented by all the college kids. 
live near your university, so you thought drunk uni students must know good pizza. You couldn't even eat a single slice of the buffalo chicken pizza from there. I don't know how one manages to mess up pizza, but they did it. It's very strange. Uh... <laughs> See, there's the I chase bad men daddy issues and my own father bullies me daddy issues. Wait, what do you mean? Black cats? <laughs> Have I been a drunk student? Can confirm that drunk students do not know what they're talking about. But I said it. I think I said something else. Maybe it just sounded like that. Because I said something about back in a while. Like, I used those exact words, but I just added something else to it in front of that. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know! It's It's been a while already. <laughs> it's too long, you, to remember. I hear it's two thieves working as a team. Hmm. Two thieves as one. A robbery? Hmm, come to think of it. I did catch a glimpse of a pint-sized fellow. Pint-sized? I know that that has to mean something else, but like, isn't pint just like half a liter? That's a very small man. <laughs> Moving suspiciously through the shadows, maybe he was involved? Judging by what we found, we're dealing with two thieves, most likely a couple of kids. Remember the pair of brothers that loiter near the water wheel? Maybe? I, I fear they may be hiding something from us. <laughs> it's fine, we can get past it together. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, pine size just means small. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> so I I take things very literal, okay? But it's like... A pint could also be like the shape. I don't know. I mean, a pint can come in different shapes. It's just the... Anyway. <laughs> anyway. Let's go have us a little chat. Okay. Then we'll be like, why the fuck did you pick this black ass? This sucks. The damage just wants to yell at you about something. No. <laughs> He's exactly 568 milliliters in volume. Did you have to Google to see how much a pint was exactly? I just said half a liter because yeah, it's close enough. And close enough. I don't. I don't know. Yet another thing that I learned from from um, uh, Lord of the Rings. <laughs> That's how I learned how much a pint is. <laughs> they come in pints. <laughs> Vep is Norwegian, they use metric, should be 568 milli- But I thought you guys use metric as well, in some cases, it's just it, when it comes to- Yeah, I thought you used metric as well in, in a lot of cases. Okay, now we can see if there are some, um- Stop stealing my jokes. <laughs> uh, that's a challenging one in the UK. Hmm. How dare you accuse of googling how many milliliters in a pint? <laughs> uh, <laughs> you order beer and milk in pints, but most of the things are measured in milliliters? Hmm. But they're still smaller things than than pints, though. Do you just like a quarter of a pint, or like one sixth of a pint? Is that how you measure stuff that is smaller than a pint? See, we have the boars here. They're still here.
You also order your bilk. <laughs> In pints. <laughs> See, we have the boar. This is not the junk heap, though. Oh, damn. It is fun to run them over, though. Ow. But then I also... <laughs> it's it's pretty funny. But Brits Brits are weird. Like why do you stone and like why do you stone to measure weight? You get half pints and in some places it tends to be crappier places, two thirds. This guy's boring. <laughs> <laughs> Not terrible, just a tough love one. The problem is you're softer than melted butter, so you can't handle it. Yeah, black hats need to be hand handled with care. You complain about this so much, fully can't make up your minds. <laughs> it's true, it's true though. Stone is an older thing, don't think you measure things in stone anymore. That's not true. I've heard a lot of people measure in stone when it comes to like their body weight and stuff. Wait, didn't 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 Richard measure himself in stones recently? Like in all seriousness as well. Because your country is old and you measured stuff with actual stone. <laughs> I guess you just never moved on from the Stone Age. I guess I don't know. Body weight, sure. Don't use kilos or just straight. Uh, I, I read that as IBS. <laughs> and, and, it's just, you know, the way that it's written is just. <laughs> makes no sense. Like, that's supposed to be pounds? Your plum is nearly empty. Ninety <laughs> percent. Not the IBS. Yeah. I saw a palm had uh, gotten a sticker with a uh, an IBS sticker. That's a drained plum scoot, but there's still a little juice in the tank. <laughs> Measurements and irritable bowels. I know. <laughs> it just, uh, it's just funny. Hey, I have a toilet emo too. Well, not me specifically, but I, I have one. This one. <laughs> Whoa, we're halfway milked. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently the LB abbreviation comes from the Latin word Libra, which means pounds, but why do you need a Latin abbreviation when it's an abbreviation for a word that isn't Latin? Makes no sense. <laughs> the little toilet guy. <laughs> Makes sense for why Libra is the scales. I guess. But it's like, you have to do so much... Like, mental gymnastics just to come up with the, the actual answer to it. Voxy, how do you teach you stuff? Yeah. <laughs> You're conquered by the Romans. True, but... Have you not moved on from that yet? 
As if your stone sign is a pounding. <laughs> uh, true, but look at the lead on the period pe periodic table, plum bum. I. What? I'm confused. <laughs> I think maybe... Wait, aren't there any rats anymore? Oh, there it is. This... <laughs> Naughty dragon. <laughs> I'm not going to correct that, because that would mean that I know what you're talking about. <laughs> Still have a let go of your Germanic, Norse, and normal language. Sure as hell not let go of <laughs> that, That's pretty funny. Uh, so the chemical symbol for lead on the periodic table is... PB comes from the Latin of it. Oh. They appear to be out at the moment. Hmm. I see, I see. Wait, does that mean that I have to save them from from the place? It's implying that you can correct it does the same effect. No, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Hey, Rods was the one who who told me about it. Okay, you can blame Rods. The ill-mannered Drake. <laughs> I mean, isn't Drake ill-mannered in 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 a manner of speaking? <laughs> I love that pub. <laughs> Hmm. You love the pub? Any pub? Just pub? Actually, tried using this. Especially the beam. <laughs> sure, sure. <laughs> I mean, is there any other kind but the public one? Wait a minute. Wicked Wyvern. I can't- I still can't get over the fact that the- this one dude on- on TikTok called it a Wyvern. In all seriousness. And then he had another person in the video with him that said the same thing. Which probably only learned it from him. Like, it's- That's definitely the name of a tavern in the Forgotten Realms. And everyone in the comment section also said that it's... I never... Oh! 
collected 50 types of raw materials. Hmm. Not so bad. Was it just engagement bait? No, it, it actually wasn't. It was not. <laughs> uh, it was... And I think I actually mentioned this on stream not too long ago. Or at least I was talking to someone. Maybe in voice chat or something. And the thing was, ow, ow, uh, it was about, uh, let me think. It was about things they do in movies and that bothers you. That is just plain wrong. Like, and, and, and like, they, they don't look into, like, the specifics of how things ac actually are. And then this guy was talking about the difference between a dragon and a wyvern. Which is something that bothers me, too. It's like, they even did it in, in Game of Thrones. They used wyverns because they thought it looked cooler. But the dragons... I don't think... Weren't they actually proper dragons in the books? But then in the show, they just made them into wyverns because the design looked cooler. But yeah, so... That's uh, what the the TikTok was about. So it wasn't rage bait. Ow. And I get it, because it bothers me, too. Hold on. Uh, I love how much you have to grind in this game to get all the achievements. <sighs> yeah, I... Unfortunately for me, I love achievements, so I'm probably gonna do it as well. So that's gonna be fun. <laughs> you will in fact take a nap and you will keep the stream open because this is relaxing. Oh, thank you. I hope you have a good nap. You have a good sleeps. How do people still not know the difference between dragon and wyverns? I don't know. I don't know. Because everyone is not a <laughs> not everyone is a nerd, but everyone should be a nerd. It's so much more fun. Boring being a nerd is awesome. It's true. It's true. Your brain is full of useless facts instead of things that could make you money. Same. <laughs> but it's because facts that can give you money... It's just boring. It's boring facts. It's not, it's not fun. I was gonna try bottlenecking it, you know, it's just better.
Necking a bottle is generally what you do too. Always a good start to a pub trip. <laughs> yep. I can imagine. Well, we have gotten quite a few uh, things here, at least. Um, if you find an audience to tell you facts to, you could be an influencer or a life coach or professor. That's true. And it also depends on what you're nerdy about as well. What your special interests are. You know? I'm just gonna play through the ads. It's not like I'm doing anything interesting. Ah, for fuck's sake. Ow! It's so confusing, this area, because there's so many different ways to go. I haven't, I haven't been looking at my health at all. I haven't... I just don't like this point of view when I get close to the door because then it, it gets like the the bird eye view as well ah 
I don't like that. Hmm. Well, we got everything here then. Which means we can go back. Oh, I need to sneeze. <sighs> that was a false alarm. But it was a close one. That was a close one. Yeah, I know it's gonna be locked. somewhere there was an el elevator as well was that in this way i don't think so no blessant yeah blessant <laughs> I guess it was before this point. Even though it's red, I know it's gonna be close, I still need to try. Every time. Just in case. I think there was an elevator on the other side there. Or was this where I came from? I do have a map. I don't know what... Okay, yeah, this is where I came from. It's supposed to be this way. This is the elevator. And uh, just put the order in, went with pizza since you found pictures online, and it looks like it could be a, cons a contender for your favorite pizza- a, a Pittsburgh pizza burg pizza. I'm not the most patient per patient person, you know. Pittsburgh pizza, Pittsburgh pizza. Really? Nothing? Nothing? At all? Okay. But there's nothing here. Hmm. You're putting your faith in a Vepri chat? That's a, that's a lot of pressure. <laughs> that's a lot of pressure. I also had pizza today, but after after all the pizza talk, I want more. <laughs> like why why is pizza so good? It's not fair.
I think I've been everywhere then, haven't I? Because I went... Yeah, I have. I can just leave then. <gasps> Craig! How you doing? Wait, shouldn't there also be like a... A pop time... Like, doesn't pop time also show pizza... Emotes? Told you it's not our fault if it sucks. This is the one that was closed, I think. I just need to double check. Pizza is unforgivably delicious. I, I know. It's like... I hate how much I love it. Yeah, this is, this is closed off now because we've already been here. This is where the quest was with the, the mother of the two brothers that work at the junk heap. So I guess it's just a way to make sure that I don't go back. Because there's nothing else to do. What are you doing, Craig? Technically speaking, if you would need it, you'd have an... out because you could say, well, I'm not chat, I'm the streamer. That's true. That is true. I also don't like calling my chat chat. <laughs> I've, I've talked about this before. I think it's so awkward when people call, uh, when streamers refer to their viewers as chat. Because it's like, that's something big streamers do, but even when they do that, it's like, unless you, your chat is so busy that you can't read anything. And because it just feels so, it doesn't feel personal at all. I feel like it's kind of weird to call you the your viewers chat, you know. Black cats, Chris Sodot. It's, it's, it's Sodot. I, I read Scoot as Sodot. Um, stupid sexy cheese disc. <laughs> I know, I know. You're back from a nap. Welcome back, Sparky Kitty Cat. I hope you had a good nap. I'll be well. Vepsy and chat, you're in another friend's birthday stream, but you'll be lurking. No worries, no worries. I hope, I hope they're having a good stream and good birthday. Unlike some folks not naming any names, you don't blame anyone other than the person who cooked the thing <laughs> if something sucks. <laughs> hmm. I need to double check to see if they're back. No. It's been five years here, so I'm wondering how, uh, if they have gotten older. But that, that would mean that we are not an android after all, because we got older. I wasn't sure, like, I've seen that there would be, like, a different haircut and everything, so, but I wasn't sure if we would get older, but we clearly did get older. Um, so that means that we are human. So I, I guess we got that answer. Uh, you can make androids that age, just look at Star Trek Picard. Well, yes, but we've seen... We've seen when he was younger, you know? Rouds! Rouds! Did someone say pizza? I did indeed. We, we did indeed talk about pizza. Happy 18 months. It's been a year and a half. A year and a half, Rods. Holy crap. It's Scoot Rod Rodley Bibbles. Yeah, Rodley Bibbles. 
Look at us, we're riding a boar. In in the best way. <laughs> we're zooming. We're zooming. <laughs> it's just so much fun. <laughs> Uh, uh, there we go. You're so behind? What do you mean? How behind? In what way? I didn't actually mean to go on the other side here. But yeah, guys, go go give Rods a follow if you haven't. But I can't imagine anyone not following Rods already. So go do it. If you for some reason are not. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to go down here and see if uh, there was a boat. You love the animation. Me too. <laughs> It's, it's so cute. Uh, the Sonic game slaps. Hey, it's better than S Sonic. I just want to get the the fairy. I wanna I wanna be able to 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 go there. Oh shit! Yeah. So we got a a side quest that we needed to go back to the facade, like the city. Before the time skip. And uh, I wonder what that was all about. <laughs> I guess we'll have to figure that out in a different playthrough. Um, hold on, let me catch up. Let me catch up. Um... Cleo be flopping on you? Is she comfy? Oh. Well, that's good. I don't know what I said. I think I just said thank you for the sub and said that it was a year and a half. I think that was all I said. I'm not sure if I said anything else. Um... You were super late on the stream because they were. I was on the bridge when you subbed, but then realized that was probably super far behind. Then you refreshed. We're already talking about stuff from later. Hmm. I don't know. But yeah, how how was stream? Are you? How far are you into Silent Hill Two? Do you think you're you're like close to the end? Pizza mentioned, to be fair, you had probably mentioned pizza a long time ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, we've been talking for, about pizza for <laughs> a good while. <laughs> um, a little bit on and off. Mm. Apparently it takes 16 hours to finish the game and you're 27 hours in. Hey, people said that this would also take, like... It, hold on. How many hours did it say that I had spent in the game? Like, uh, just finishing the game would take about... Was it 18 or 19 hours? I have 20... 21. No. Yeah, 21 hours in the game. <laughs> Wait, you played the game for 27 hours already? But I feel like you just started. Wait, haven't you just streamed here for like three streams? How have you managed to... Wait... Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I forgot to do that. Um... How am I liking it? 
I'm I'm really enjoying this game. I I absolutely love this game now. <laughs> And it's making me want to play Automata as well. Now that I, I feel like I'm more invested, now I actually want to play that. Even though I've tried Automata twice and failed to continue playing it, now I want to do it. This game just feels like a better way to start the whole series. So when people say to skip this and just go straight for Automata, I do not agree. That was not the way to go for me. <laughs> you know, the same takes so long games. I, but it, it's important to enjoy it, you know? We're not rushing through it. It's been five streams. One of the top VEP games now? I don't know yet about that. I would have to finish it first to say. Near My Tomato? Yeah, I'm probably going to be playing that after this. But I, I kind of want to get all the endings for this before I move on to Automata. Are you two the ones behind the recent robberies? I'm just doing some side quests now. One thing that I'm not the biggest fan of, though, is that all the side quests are basically just fetch quests. Um, but that's also part of the lore. Because, you know, this is not a spoiler, by the way, because you've already seen that part. But it's like, when you go here with your sister and everything, like... That's just them doing, doing you a favor by letting you be an errand boy to get money. So it's like, it makes sense. I feel the same even from the little you played because you think you gave up on Automata faster than the amount you played of Replicant. Same, yeah, I played I played Automata for like five hours each, both times. But yeah, I feel like I mentioned it so many times, but this game just makes you care more from the start. So you feel more invested from the beginning. While Automata is just... It just drops you into uh, all the action. You know, all the action without having any context, you just figure it out as you go. And that's... I feel like that works better if, if it's... if you haven't played... Well, I mean, if you if you played this before. But if you just jump straight into Automata, it's very dif like, difficult to... to care, you know? All the endings doesn't it have like 28 well i mean those are also just very like small variations but that's automata i mean this one this one has five endings i think but it's like you don't have to start from the beginning each time absolutely no skipping games in the stream yeah <laughs> Thank you, Rods. Big heart? What do you mean? Action sucks. Story rocks. Oh, well, yeah. For the most part, I would I would definitely say that I prefer story over action, but I, li I like both. I thought they all had an insane amount of endings, uh, but like they're only. Apparently, both this and Automata has... I think it's five endings, both of them. Like, main endings. And then they have, like, small variations. So they're, like... You know, kind of like Elden Ring. It has, like, three... Endings with achievements, and those are, like, the main main endings, you know? But then there are different variations depending on other quests you've done and stuff. I don't know how the variations work in this one, though. But it's like, it's kind of similar. Um, Big heart. A lot of love to give games. Yeah, but only games. Not 
Not gross people, though, because people do be gross. Yeah, that's true. That's true. You must already know if you're asking like that. Your tone betrays your guilt. Confess. Confess now. Lest the rage of Grim War Wise fall upon you. Hmm. Okay, we did it. My brother and me. Why? His dad told us to. <laughs> Imagine having a dad telling you to steal. So scared to put your fluffy winter boots on because you haven't worn them in a year. What if there's spooders in there? But you just, just... Turn them upside down and shake them a little bit and use a vacuum in it if you are worried. What do you seduce? Put a sock on your hand and rummage in there? No! That sounds awful. <laughs> no human love? Nah, not <laughs> Plus your shoes have a hole at the front, so when you did that, you guess they could escape your rage uh, without dying. Mm. Just multiple layers of sock. I would hate that. I can't even step on... on spiders or anything i can't just knowing that it's been underneath like and I'd, i'm not even scared of spiders i just don't want to touch them i just want to be near them even if it's like even if i'm just touching something that is touching them you heard the phrase toxic. what scoots I'm I'm streaming by myself now, okay? I'm not streaming with Chris and Lore. <laughs> no, I'm just, kidding. just kidding. Feel about spiders like I feel about humans? No, I mean, mm. no, because I like hugs and stuff. Your own father demanded that you steal? This guy sounds like a real piece of work. Where is he now? Probably in the tavern. That's where he spends all his time. Got it. God damn it. Your dad is just drinking. Um. Hug confirm? Yeah, I like hugs. Um, you've never been bitten? Hmm. Well, it's not about being bitten for me, at least. Well, thank you for the hug! <gasps> Devil, do you want to sing? Hmm. What do we got today? Hmm. The Masterless Lighthouse? <gasps> Wait, is the old lady dead? Got a job from Seafront, if you aren't too busy. It's a guy looking for something. Look, just go ask him, alright? Sure. Sure. Mm, I wrote down the client's location on your map, so head over there to get the details. Yeah, I've been to the... I've been there before. You missed Diamond and Lauren, but Chris was here. Lauren wasn't, though, but Chris was here. Uh, Hawks are great. They are. They are. I don't remember the last time I had a proper hug, if I'm being honest. <laughs> like, sure, it's been like a very, very, like, quick and shallow type of hug. But not like an, a proper hug. That's been ages. They're such nice young men. Wait, Chris and Lauren? <laughs> uh, you're arachnophobic to some degree. What do you mean, some degree? That sounds like full-on arachnophobia, blackheads. You haven't been hugged in years? But 
But you live with your parents, Rods. The other day, your therapist asked you what would make you feel better. All you could come up with, come out with, a, was a hog. Are your parents allergic to hugs? I mean, I'm, I'm just, like, I also see my mom every now and then, but that's what I mean. But like, I don't really hug my mom. But like, it has happened that she gives you like a super shallow hug. That's like, like, just slightly. You know, touching your cheek, but it's not like a hug, you know, like a hug. So it's like, eh, that doesn't count. Yeah. Just touch cheek, but no arms involved on their part. That's the same with my mom as well. Damn. Our parents are cold. <laughs> Hey, you have a pair of sons? Huh? Was it to you, huh? Why you gotta ask me all the... Why you gotta ask me all the questions? You're forcing kids to commit crimes? Crimes? No, no. It's not like that. I just, just told him to go find some food for the family. Now shut your mouth before I, before I shut it for you. Bunch of no good meddlers. Mm. Our, Our time is wasted on this drunken uh, scoundrel. What a sad excuse for a father. Mm, how should we explain this to the client? We'll tell him the truth. Then we'll figure out what to do with the kids. Yeah. They stand arms down? That's so sad. When all the things you and I are the same about are the sad things. <laughs> Uh, we just just gotta laugh through the pain, Rods. <laughs> oh. The weird thing for you is that even though your mother is really warm and you s still feel far away, brains are weird. Hmm. Hmm. That is kind of interesting, though. Going to pick up the foods and don't want to accidentally butt pan? But, 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 oh, butt ban. I, I said butt pan? I don't know why I said butt pan. <laughs> uh, butt ban. Yeah, no, no butt banning. <laughs> Did you find the culprit? Yeah, but it's complicated. I have to say, I don't feel like the voice he has fits him very well. I feel like the voice sounds like someone who's like 40 or something instead. Are your children dr uh, dream to steal by an abusive father? Well, I certainly didn't expect this. Ah, okay, it's not that bad as like as I thought. It just it, the 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 voice sounded a little bit older than I imagined. But uh, butt pan, it's a frying pan in the shape of a butt, perfect for making waffles. <laughs> not the waffles. Uh, they shouldn't have stolen from you, but I don't think they're entirely at fault here. So this Agreed. I'll talk to the other shopkeepers and make sure they understand. Thanks. Oh, and I also think we should get them away from their father. Mm. Not sure who could take them. Folks are barely getting by as it is, but let me spread the word and see what we can figure out. 
Ah, yes, your fee. Well, shop owners passed the hat and came up with this. Hope it's enough. <gasps> 3,000? Using children's uh, tools for thievery? Unthinkable. <laughs> Mm. Not the butt waffles. But that you, you're the one who said it. But you don't make waffles in a pan. Don't you mean butt pancakes? I guess this is where we need to go. Not the butt, butt pancakes. So the big one has a return here. You'd struggle to make pancakes in a butt pan. It would all slump together to make a waffle of sorts. I was just imagining, you know, a regular pan, but, but that had like a... That wasn't completely round, but it had like a butt shape. Ow. That's what I was picturing. So it would be like have a flat bottom. <laughs> hey, flat butts are butts too, you know? Don't discriminate against flat butts. Dude, I'm trying to... That's what I was trying to do. You were thinking of a 3D pan, so two big semi-circle types. <laughs> uh, I, I was just thinking a more realistic one. Like something that would actually exist, you know? Well, I mean, I'm not saying that couldn't ex exist either. I guess it could. Someone had formed a piece of steel through the shape of their ass. <laughs> uh, so, like a butt mold? You could make one of those. So do it. I mean, if you want to. Like, now you, you, you're actually eating my. <laughs> That's, that sounds weird. No, don't do that. Just, just let them know beforehand that it is an actual uh, copy of, of your butt, you know? Otherwise, I feel like it would be... It would kind of lack consent, you know? I feel like that's important to say. <laughs> you come back 
to butt mold. Hey, this this was Scoot, okay? Not me. Um, you should make one of those. <laughs> but welcome back, Rons. Um. It would not be eating your butt, but on on your butt. Wait, what do you mean on your butt? Get friends over breakfast, and now for the main course. <laughs> <laughs> Always if like no, but it's it's true. He was talking about making a butt mold. I didn't. Because you're not eating the butt mold, but it is being used as a plate, right? No! No. Um. Um. Hold on. Using it to make waffles that are in the shape of your butts. Yeah. That's that's what we meant. <laughs> it's like those those jiggly jellos from Japan. <laughs> uh. Yeah, yeah. That that would be funny. <laughs> Double helpings for, for Chris. At least you know that. Could slap <laughs> Only with consent, okay. Wait, so if if you had a if you had a mold of your butt that people made jellos out of and they wanted to slap it, would they have to ask you for consent? <gasps> There's a ship here. This was not. This has not been here before. Ooh. Yeah, it was just full of fat seals. <gasps> Wait, where are the fat seals? I want to go up there, but first I want to see if there are any seals. I can't see any. Wouldn't it always be double helping? I guess. Don't call it, but that's... I can't get up there. But they're all lardy and stuff, Rods. It's to keep the insulation. They became the boats. It seems so. Did you marry the woman you were talking about five years ago? <sighs> <laughs> what the way things are these days, I can't afford to keep giving my girl gifts. Now she won't even talk to me. Wait, you've been you've been at it with this woman for five years? And she only wants you for your gifts? Yeah, I, I'd say it's about time you dump her. Um, You don't think so? It's just jello after all? But they would kind of be, you know... I'm, I don't know. Lord, what's your nickname for? Wait. But... Did they call you Lardy? In, in Portuguese, then? Now you're just not making any sense, Rods. If your girl demands gifts so you go broke, you're, do, you're doing something wrong. Yeah. Um, but you said growing up. I assumed you meant like when you were little. Hey, you got a moment? You used to be friends with the lighthouse lady, right? Well, friends is a bit of a stretch. As I remember it, we basically hated each other. <laughs> oh, well, you at least talked to her, right? Could I ask you a favor? What is it? 
The lighthouse is in good shape now, but it's going to wear out eventually. We'd like to have replacement parts ready. You think you can get the parts from the junk heap for me? I just went there. I'm sure the lighthouse lady would be uh, appreciative wherever she is. I mean, I might have the stuff anyway. Yeah, all right. Thank you. I think we'll need 10 broken lenses and 10 broken batteries. Mm. And while you're at it, 10 mysterious switches would be nice too. What do you- I'm one person! Okay, how much do I have? Three? You fucking kidding me? I just went there. Oh. You went to an American school from age three to 18? But how come? Did, did your parents want you to go there to learn English? They thought it was important. I mean, it is useful, though. So wouldn't people learn English in, in school there in general? I mean, I know that people don't necessarily learn English everywhere, but... You're full of lore. It's true. It's true. Bards is full of the lore. The Lord of Lore. Let's see. No. But where did all the seals go? There's not even seals here. I miss them because they were so cute. <laughs> Not really. If people want to learn English, they need to go to a secondary school that teaches English or go to an international school like you did. Oh, well, that's interesting. They did a fusion in into the boat. No, that's so sad. You don't believe in them? Hey, Slim, how you doing? Hold on. I'll give you a head pat. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. There we go. Hey, look at Sirius. He's... he's... There. I don't have my camera mirrored, so I I, I can't point. <laughs> Do ghosts die every time someone says they don't believe in them? Yeah, they get like more and more uh, invisible until they just completely disappear. Ross doesn't believe in you, no. <laughs> uh, but how you doing, Slim? Um... <laughs> <laughs> ah, it's you. I've heard a great many stories about you. Making quite the name for yourself, hmm? Yeah, I don't know about that. Oh, no need to be so modest. After all, I may have a job for someone with a partic your particular talents. What's that supposed to mean? I'm listening. Uh, you should see the picture of Sirius posted in Discord. He very flu. Yeah, he fell asleep in the window. <laughs> um. 
But you're doing well. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm also doing well. I mean, having a chill Saturday. Much like your wife, you're a figment of your imagination. <laughs> no. There's no way even your imagination could make up someone as wonderful as Ghost. Hmm. I'm pretty real you made a deal with the Grim Reaper. That's how you with us, guys. But we don't- we haven't actually seen you, though. So, you know, it could just be a ghost rider, you know? It could just be a ghost rider. That was- I did that on the spot. You can tell. <laughs> I'm listening. I need you to retrieve three crates of particular import from a ship that was wrecked at sea. Mm. So that's what this uh, ship is for. This cargo has likely washed ashore on all the far-flung corners of the world, so it would be a task of some difficulty. Can I count on your assistance? Sure. I can't catch a ghost on a camera. But I'm not saying on camera. I'm just saying IRL. No one has seen you IRL. Sure, no problem. Ah, excellent, excellent. Oh, and whatever you do, you must not unseal the cargo. I've heard that one before. Well, now I'm curious. Why can't I open it? Mm. Hey, Vapor! Go to sleep! Go to sleep! <laughs> Gotta feed the kitty! BRB, go feed the kitty. Um, I think that is the opposite. You can only catch ghosts on cameras and not vampires. That's... I guess that's also true. Well, I mean, I guess that's true. Your cats have, but we don't know your cats. But yeah, why can't I open it? I was shipping some rather unique products. If you were to see them, it might place me in something of a dilemma. Hey, it's your money. You don't want me to look? Fine. But I'm nosy. I want to know. I want to know. Wait, hold on. Let me save. I haven't saved in a while. Ba -da -ba. Hello? Hey, I know you. You're that kid who takes any job, no matter how weird or demeaning. <laughs> Not really how I'd phrase it, but okay. I got a merchant ship that needs some repairs. Think you can round up some materials for me? I need five logs, 20 dented metal boards, and 10 strip bolts. And ask if you're up for it, but I know you are. Uh -huh. I don't like the... I don't like your attitude. But fine. That hardly seems necessary. A trading business, huh? Is something the matter? No, it's just that... Well, I've never left this area. Got me wondering what it would be like to visit another, another country. I'd love to take Yona on a trip like that sometime. Someday you shall. Ah, oh, well, I'm sure of it. I had a quest for this dude, and I never got to finish it. Thank you, I will drink some water. Ghosts who have been caught on camera just sloppy you will want to be famous. Hmm. Let's see if there's any. No, not here. The this this door. I don't. 
think there would be anything new here, but I kind of want to check anyway. do this again I forgot that is also a way to do it. Ah. Nothing new. Yeah, did I just never get the chance to fix the the fairy? Because I ended up progressing in the main quest too quickly? Because I did everything I was supposed to do with that, I don't understand. You need to get going, but I hope you have a great stream. Have have a good one, Rods. Thank you for stopping by. Hope you have a good rest of your Saturday. Oh. I'm so tired today. I'm tired. You return, welcome back, Scoot. Scoot, Scoot. I wonder if there will be some cargo around the ship here. This is one of the pieces of cargo that washed ashore. Should we look inside or should we pick it up without looking inside? I, I already, I feel like I already know what you guys will say, but she did tell us not to look in inside the boxes. I can kick it. <laughs> That's not an option. <laughs> but like... Mm. Okay, if anyone... If anyone in chat has seen this... Before. If anyone watching has seen this before... Will I get an achievement either way? <laughs> <laughs> because if it's not attached to any achievements, I don't care. Don't look at what's inside, you say? Mm. But what if it's something dangerous, though? Pole? I mean, we could have a pole. Wait, hold on. Let me... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna skim... Let's see. I, I don't want to get any spoilers.
It's like I see you defeated and that's all I'm reading. But they're hidden achievements. I can't I can't watch. I can't look at it. You can double check you got any achievements. What's my quest called? Uh, can I click out of this? I don't know if I can. I can't. So I can't see the quest because I'm still in the in the thing. So I'm not allowed to look at the quest. <laughs> the scattered cargo. I mean, I think that. Yeah, that sounds that sounds about right. That sounds accurate. Are you back with a good moment of truth incoming? Please let us let us know, Black Hats. Yeah, I mentioned that there would be cargo spread uh, around many different places, but she told us to not look inside. But I'm a nosy person. The wiki doesn't say anything about an achievement. Okay. Mm. Okay, we can do a poll. I can do a poll. Let me see. I'm gonna leave it up for about three minutes. There we go. O open it or not open it. <laughs> so m vote what we should what we should do. It's probably not super important anyway, but it could also be. You never know. But also thank you for for checking, Scoot. I appreciate it. <sighs> I'm tired. <laughs> Game is also so chill. Thank you to everyone who said pizza is pretty good and definitely the best buffalo chicken pizza you've had on this side of the state. <gasps> Ooh, that's good, Black Hats. I'm glad, I'm glad. Mood. Yeah, it's it's been raining so much today that I, it makes me sleepy. <laughs> Black Hat's getting the good pizza. Mm. Ghost, you said no to open it, though. Have you voted? Because no one has voted no. So now I'm curious. Did you change or haven't you voted? You like rain? I like rain too, but it does make me very sleepy. But yeah, don't forget to vote on the poll whether we should open it. <laughs> whether we should open the, the, the box or not. You wish you were sleepy. For some reason, you woke up at 5 a.m. this morning, stayed up for a few hours, then went back to sleep. Damn. Damn. I also vo 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 woke up. Uh, I also woke up uh, pretty early because of my cats, and then it took me a while before I went back to sleep. I guess that's why I'm also tired now. I guess. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to open the the cargo and see what's inside. Watch it be like a shade or something. That was my immediate thought, that maybe we do have to open it because maybe it's something dangerous, like a shade or something. Maybe she's smuggling shades. 
glad you got a blindfold. It came in clutch this morning, tried to sleep while the sun was up. Hmm. Yeah, it's very useful to have. Well, I guess I guess we're opening the cargo. Look inside before picking it up. Sorry, lady, but I need to know what I'm transporting here. Are you sure this is really something we were meant to... Oh. What is this? Whatever it is. It's been waterproofed somehow, and it smells like explosives. I did say it could be something dangerous. This is some rather dangerous cargo we've been asked to find. It is filled with strange potions and documents. What on earth was that old woman transporting? Yeah, like I feel like we have the right to know if we ask we're asked to transport it, you know? That intake of breath me prepare myself for jump skip. <laughs> uh, all you never know what to expect. I wonder if she can tell though, if we uh Oh, and a man of reason on top of everything else. Oh, I do so appreciate your help in this matter. Okay, so I need to talk to her after I found everyone, every single one. Uh, search the shorelines and find three pieces of cargo. Okay, I'm wondering if there is one here as well. No. It's probably on a... in different areas. I kind of want to go on a, on a little hunt to find all the cargo now. Because the map isn't huge. Like, there's not that many places. There aren't that many places to go. Hey, it's a boar waiting for us. Oh, wait. We were supposed to go up there, too. No. Ugh. But I don't want to. I don't want to end up progressing in the main quest again, and miss out on stuff. If I had known that there was a point of no return there, I would have made sure to finish uh, the side quests that I was on. A giant egg. The little leggies. Hey. How goes the game? You know, it wasn't super long, but still, it's going pretty well. I don't know, there's just something about this game that feels kind of comforting in a way, because it's... I guess it's a combination of the music and like the, the mix between combat and chill stuff. Because you have like this home base with the the village here and everything and I don't know it just it just feels really nice to play I enjoy wait what what was up here again I don't think there is any but there are any shores up here but I'm gonna double check. Is 
It's a Lizzie. As in a lizard, not not Liz. I know you don't like being called Lizzie. I know that. <gasps> it's a little boar. When you deliver cargo or anything, you really don't care what it is, but you will love it. The shop where you get your packages, make sure that they have place a sticker on breakable objects. That's fair. I would say that that is probably a little bit different, though. Because then you're not the one who is responsible for... If you're delivering something that could be potentially dangerous, because... You're just like the, 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 the middle man, you know? Or like, I guess you're the middle middle man because you're... Some, I don't know. You thought we were talking about the queen for a second there? Lizzie? But she did. So, Dot, are you back from a nap? Did you nap? I haven't been here in ages. I don't know if I even can go here anymore. Well, it seems like I can. Don't think you can venture in here again. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. This view is kind of cool, though. That it zooms out when you go there. I find it absolutely pathetic on his end, not yours, that your own uncle can't remember... That you hate Lizzie and yet your friend all over across the globe never, who's never met you in person can remember that. I don't think it has anything to do with remembering then. It's just a matter of being disrespectful and not... Like, respecting your wishes. He sounds like someone who just does the opposite just because... He doesn't like being told what to do. Which shouldn't matter in that case, because it shouldn't be about him at all. You did nap? You were hugging a plushie all the time? What 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 type of plushie? You just want to get that off your chest because you deliver glass objects without even knowing. Yeah, that's... that's annoying. You appreciate me remembering that? But of course I do. It's actually very interesting that you say that because... Um, I think... Uh, I don't really have to try that hard because I just end up remembering a lot of things even though I'm not necessarily making an effort to do so. But I feel like if you have trouble remembering things, if I did have trouble with it, I would still try to because Well, for me, it's kind of like a, a love language in a way. Like I really, I'm so used to not people not remembering anything. Um, that I say, that for me it's kind of like a, it just means that I feel like people care extra much if they do. Oh, 50 hit combo. Wait, I haven't gotten that yet. Yeah. 
Um, I just feel like it shows that you bother to listen. And that you care about the person. That doesn't mean that I think that people who are forgetful don't care. Because I still do believe that people care, but it's just... That's why it's kind of part of a love language, because it's... It's like something extra, you know? But at the same time, I don't feel like it should be something extra. I don't know. A tea weasel. <laughs> uh. And to be loved is to be known, is what you think? That's a good, good way to look at it. Weasels are just cute weasels. Dick weasels are removed from weasels are simply a term for bad humans. Yeah. You feel that? So used to people not remember anything? You're the same? You make a real effort to remember things to show how much you love and care about people? I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad it's not just me. That I, I also feel like that's important. So when people say, like, Oh, didn't you say that and that you you like this or you like and then I just I get <laughs> you remembered. <laughs> I just I just get really happy because I'm not used to that. Um So I totally understand it being a love language. Yeah, so I- when people remember things that I say, it doesn't- it doesn't go unnoticed. I definitely remember it. <laughs> I remember that people remember. Um, Certain enemy attacks are capable of inflicting poison status. Poison will clear up on its own after enough time has passed, but it can also be cured right away by using an antidotal weed. Hmm. Interesting. I definitely have to look at my um my health. He does it just to be disrespectful. He's the one your dad punched at a family barbecue because of a rude thing he called you while you're away getting help at treatment. He's just an asshole that does it because he, you hate it. Yeah, some people are like that, unfortunately. Assholes. You still expect people to forget your birthday. You remember saying to your friends, thought you forgot as you hugged them when they turn up on a doorstep as a surprise birthday present. That would have made me cry, Scoot. That is so sweet. I also don't expect people to remember my birthday. Unless I, you know, if, if they made an effort to remember once, then it's like, I feel like they probably remember it the next time as well, possibly. Um, 
But if they haven't, like, shown or implied that they've known before, I always get surprised as well. You didn't truly understand how much of a love language it is. Even when people started to point out how you just remembered things, you were like, oh, doesn't everyone? That's sad. Yeah, I I also, well, we've already talked about this before, uh, but I also feel like it's kind of sad when, it's like, I also assumed that I had a n normal memory. <laughs> I didn't think that I remembered a lot more than other people. Um, so it took me a, a long time before I had to adjust and, and not expect that much from other people. So now I don't. <laughs> but it still makes me kind of sad when, when people don't remember uh, as much. Uh, especially if it's something that is important. The effort is appreciated and you're sweet bean. No, you. You, black cats. <laughs> but yeah, your, your uncle seems like an asshole. And you don't deserve that. You did cry. Oh, <laughs> oh that's, that's really sweet of them, though. Give me a few moments to go freshen up before we go out. Actually goes and sobs in the house. Dude, I... <laughs> I don't think I could wait that long. I would probably just start sobbing right then and there. <laughs> uh, I'm almost crying right now. Talking about it. Um, <laughs> but that is totally understandable. I would also try to go and hide if, if that was the situation. Um... <laughs> It only took one session in therapy to decide he's not worth the effort because, as your therapist reminded you, blood is- yeah, does not equal family. I agree. I agree. Are you dead now? I guess I do have one of those uh, weeds. I have seven. I wonder if there's anything to do in here. You didn't want to cry all of Curdo's nice clothes. Wait, it was Curdo as well. I haven't seen Curdo in ages. We received a thank you letter from the children I used to take care of. I guess they turned out all right. No idea what I was doing when I started, but now I have the confidence to keep performing my job. Do you like flowers? Yeah. Sure, I guess. Why? I love flowers, but there are so few out here in the desert. <clears throat> My dream is to find some flower seeds and turn this desert into a beautiful garden. I'm trying to collect pink moonflower seeds. It would be great if you, if I could get ten of them. Sure. If I can track them down, they're all yours. <gasps> really? Thank you. How many do I have? I have none. <laughs> There's so many important things to remember. There's so many small details about people to remember, like their favorite color and what textures they don't like in food and 
what special moment in their life lights up their eyes and when they talk about it. So many things that make us who we are. I agree. I agree. And it's... I feel like... You know, this is actually interesting. Because I've thought about this before. I feel like this is a... This is something that kind of goes hand in hand. People who are good at giving gifts are also people who have good memory and, and you know, remembers the things you say. Because it's like, if you manage to give people gifts that they haven't necessarily said when you ask, like, what do you wish for, like, your birthday and Christmas or whatever, but you give them something that they have mentioned like once in passing or something then you know like that is like that is like two takes that you get um uh, on the love language <laughs> because it's like you listened to me and you gave me a gift you know it's like that's like the ultimate thing that's like i recommend anyone to pay attention to the people they care about. When they say that, oh, look at that, that looks so cool, I want that, you know? If they say that, just once, in passing. And then they might just forget about it later, that they said it. But then they will remember that, oh, I said that once and you listened to me? You know? So yeah. Try to, to, to think about that. Because I don't think anyone... Not a single person that I could think of would not appreciate that. It was Quirto, Lana, and Kifla. He flew in, speci in specially for it. Aww. That's really sweet. He's taking a step back from the internet a bit, but he's been helping you pick out car cycle level being his. Oh, that's understandable. Sometimes you just need a break. Well, that's good though. That you, you're keeping in touch anyway. But thank you for the lurk, Slim. I appreciate it. You definitely had the hideaway happy cry moments. Think we all have. <laughs> feel super validated by that. They usually do forget that they said it. It's so happy to see them happy. Yeah, I I I think it's a really nice gesture at least. Let's see if we can talk to the prince here now, or I guess he would be the king now. I have to wait for the the fleet again. I saw it move past here, but I did mention this when I first went here a couple of streams ago. That using the that little raft here. Is something that I could just watch forever. Well, you will see when I when it actually arrives, though. <laughs> there it is. Just, just doing this. You could just sit and watch this for a really long time. Because the music is, is chill. The colors are nice and warm. And then it's just, it's just a cozy, cozy little screensaver type of deal. After only ever having bad partners in the past, the first birthday you had with Rob, and he not only acknowledged it, but actually got a card and gift. Something you said you wanted months before, had you run away to the bathroom and you thought, 
You hated it meanwhile. <laughs> I'm really crying. What is this? A trick of some sort? Oh, that's adorable. Black hats. This time the plushie was a bunny? Oh. I guess Scoot is uh, particularly partial to a bunny. But yeah, you seem to have find a really found a really good partner in 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 Rob, especially compared to to all the other stuff you've had to deal with. Do you carry axles and paddle boards? I'm afraid I'm out of stock, but I could make could make them if you bring me iron ore and logs. How much do you need? Ten of each should suffice. I'll be back in a bit. Hmm. I didn't know that I had to go here for a different quest. Hmm. I don't have any logs. Um, three years later, Meriden's still wondering when it will be revealed that it was all a trap for what you don't know, but something. Dude, I think I would feel the same way. I think I would feel the same way. I guess it's something that happens when you have trust issues and stuff as well. It kind of makes sense. As a bunny plush, you got us a gift for graduating from your bachelor's degree. <gasps> Ooh, nice. Hmm. I also have some plushies in my bed, but I can't actually, like, hug them in my sleep anymore because of my weighted blanket. <laughs> because then it's just, I can't have it under the blanket and I can't have it over it because if I have my arms over the, over it, it will, I will get cold. Are you the one who saved our king? I didn't save him so much as just find him. We owe you a great debt. We would be nothing without him to guide us. By the way, do you happen to possess a royal compass? You do not, my good man. Pray eluc elucidate us uh, elucidate us on the nature of this object. It allows you to traverse sandstorms without losing your way. It's one of our most handy tools. Feels, please feel free to take it. Oh, looks valuable. You sure? Of course, the mass people always repay their debts. Then we would be honored to receive it. Royal Compass. Do you have more to say? Excuse me, are you looking for work right now? What kind of work? The rules state that we must make a ceremonial mask for our king, and I need help collecting the materials. Sure. You can do that. Thank you, I'll need two things from you. One is titanium alloy, which can be found in the junk heap. The other is a crystal, which is a special type of ore. I'll need one of each item. I do think I have the alloy, but don't think I have a crystal. Yeah, exactly. It's just so diabolical that our brains can be conditioned to think genuine kindness is a trick of some sort. 
after your brain has been slowly coming around to realizing that it's not true. Not just because of him, but because of all your sweet bean friends. You are not mine too. Oh. Yeah, it's um it could take some time. I would imagine. Enter the king's mansion. Mm. Oh, I haven't been in here before. Wait, we could just go straight to the king's bedroom? That's wild. Look at this view! I actually really like this little city. I feel like that's probably one of the m most memorable memorable places in the game. In the sense that it's like the structure and everything. It's kind of unique. It's interesting. Hello? The special day approaches, we must dispatch the wolves. Wait, what special day? What special day? I wonder if these people use the same mask for life. Beats me. Maybe they wash them. I mean... I would assume that they do. But assuming... Uh, that people have good hygiene... Uh, I made that mistake before. I mean, I did get a- oh, hey! A compass, but I don't know if it's actually gonna help me in any way. Hey! Hmm. You know what they say about assuming? Mm, I mean... N never to assume, I guess? Wash your masks and your assholes, people. Yeah. <laughs> uh, a, res a respectable... <laughs> I think maybe I should uh, avoid doing this yet. Like, uh, I don't, I don't know if I don't know if it's gonna be necessary to do this again anyway. Going to that area, but hey. I have a little pudding sitting next to me. Is 14% proud? Uh, 93%. Damn. Wait. Uh. 
Did I just find something? Looks like we can't get in here. Huh. Cool. Not that I could go there, but at least I found it. Not the first time you heard that. <laughs> Uh, pudding? Yeah, I call him, uh, I call him Pudding. Sirius is a little pudding. Need to make Danman more proud of the whole 14%? Yes, yes you do. Oh, so the door will open up to whatever that is. I did look at that when I went past here, but I guess it's probably going to be something quest related that I can't get to yet. 41% that's better. Not great, but it is better. Honestly, though, I don't- I don't necessarily agree with that saying. That it will make an ass out of you and me, because in a lot of cases I feel like it would make an ass out of at least the other person. If we're talking about, uh, you know, the... Should I say it? We've talked about it a few times before. You know, about men's um, butt hygiene. <laughs> I don't think that that would make an ass out of me. That would certainly make an ass out of them. You just flipped the one and the four. Oh, I didn't even think about that. That's true. Um, you finally finished all your assignments before 3 a.m. That's your fault for not doing them earlier and leaving them for later your beat. Get some rest, ghost. Get some rest. Wow. <laughs> He's just sitting here. Hey. Oh. 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 He loves giving me a, a a tail mustache. <laughs> hey. Hey. Mm hmm. No. Yo. Hey. <laughs> no. He's such a cutie. So when he sits like this, I tend to just, you know, just just do this. And give him a, a good hug. <laughs> he likes that. He actually doesn't mind. I I can give him proper hug, like with both arms. N nice mustache, thank you, thank you. I've had it for about 13 years. You hear a purr? Yeah, he, he has he has some pretty loud purrs. The buffalo pizza has already done damage? Oh no. <laughs> no, Chris. <laughs> uh, father will never be proud of you. That's not true. That's not true. Vepistache? Hmm. 
He knows his mother is missing the fine dwarven beard that all women should have. Yeah, he's just he's just helping me out. He's such a baby. <laughs> he is. He is a baby. 80s would not accept a hug like that. But he gives you he gives you the 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 head head boobs. I mean he he like my cats don't like that. They don't do that. So if I move my head like towards them to like headbutt them, that's what the word I was looking for. The the headbutts. They they don't do that. <laughs> And that makes me sad that they don't want to do the headbutts. Very boopable. He is very boopable. He's such a cutie, though. Yeah, cats are, like, there's so much, uh, personality in cats. They're all so different. He do clonks you with his old round boy head. <laughs> oh, I love that. I miss it, because the first cat that we had, well, the first cat that I had growing up, um, he did that all the time. And I loved it. Yeah, I really want to go and find the cargo. I know that the main quest is going to find Emil. Um, to talk about Kaina and stuff. But I don't really want to do that yet. Hey, there's cargo there. Looks like this is one of the pieces of cargo that washed ashore. Should I? Well, seeing as we looked at the first one, we might as well look at this one too. Yeah. A little peek shouldn't hurt, you know, just in case. Just in case. Just in case. What exactly? Need I remind you that? Hmm, what are those? Unlabeled medicine bottles with some kind of white powder inside. Hmm. Huh. Given how carefully they were packed, I doubt we are dealing with sugar. Drifting cargo three. Drugs and explosives again? Just what is all this for? A supply this size could provide for the military of a small country. Seems you human are incapable of learning from the mistakes of the past. That is very true. That is very true, wise. Wise is very wise. You swear for as small as garbage is, he has a thick ass head. Hurts when he headbutts you free. <laughs> That's all. Oh no, it's the forbidden flower. It seems so. It seems so. Dude, I didn't want to deal with that right now. I don't think that the other cargo is going to be here, but... I do need to check. He was from Glasgow in a past life. <laughs> you do love that Hades is around boy void because ladies around girl void, so they match perfectly. Oh.
Yeah, I don't know where the, the other one should be because there's not a lot of water. So these are the the woods. This is a very small area, so might as well go here first. Ladies and Haiti. <laughs> Two Ron voids just be be booping through life. The home of that blast of dream. Yeah. Truly a nightmare. I hope never to experience again. I hear you. Yeah, this was rough. We did this last time. Oh, you're still here? How you been lately? Me? I've been doing just great. Well, that's good to hear. Tree branch. I haven't had any dreams at all lately. Well, that's good, considering how your dreams were last time I was here. That big tree in the heart of the village is known as the Divine Tree. Hmm. Yeah, nothing to do here. That's kind of what I figured, but I wanted to check. Seeing as it's... So we've gone through um, a time skip of like five years just in this stream. So... I wanted to see if anything had changed in some of these areas. Her ears peeked up <laughs> when I read your message. Oh, Lady in Hades. Haiti and ladies. No. Royal Fern. Leave me alone. Ladles and Hadles. Ladles and Hadles. Oh yeah, the music here is the one that gets muted in on YouTube. <laughs> just saying. Um, also, let me just... I'm not gonna st stay here for very long though. I just wanna see if it's... There can't be anything to do here. Uh, related to the cargo, at least. But I have found two. Hmm. Hey, boar, I need a- I need a ride. I need a rod. <laughs> I don't think I'm ever- um, I've ever- I'm, I'm ever gonna go- go get- get sick of this. It's just- <laughs> it's just so funny. Like, very- very anime. Coded run. But it makes it more difficult to avoid uh, crashing into, into walls and stuff. You can't do very sharp turns. Could the cargo had have been- Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah! 
yeah. Look at that. This is where the, the last cargo is. I think this is one of the pieces of cargo that washed ashore. Look inside. No offense to that lady, but I am not carrying around some box unless I know what's inside. Have you assuaged your guilt with that feeble excuse? Then I suggest we, uh... Hello? What do we have here? I've never seen flowers like this. They smell... weird. I believe they can be refined into a powerful yet poisonous drug. I doubt very much that they are illegal. Well, that seems to be all of it. A tremendous cache of illegal goods and dangerous materials. I'd wager my title page that our client is a smuggler. So what should we do? What should we do, though? She's an old lady as well, but I'm not sure. Should we report it? Or should we deliver it to the old lady? This is the best. It's so silly. It is. <laughs> She needs a ride. You got a free back, sir. It's true. It's true. Initial B. Hmm. Deja bore. <laughs> Deja bore. Oh, I'm not gonna sing that, but I, uh, I'm, I'm singing it in my head. What do you guys think? Should we report it? I'm kind of leaning towards reporting it because it's like there's so much like there's explosives and drugs and and just delivering it back to her would mean that we're accomplices, you know? Now that we know what's inside. I feel like I kind of want to see what happens if I do report it, though. I'm gonna try doing that. I don't want to be a party to smuggling, or worse, let's start with the guard at the entrance. Yeah, let's... Like, I'm also considering the world that this all takes place in and how unless it's like mm -hmm. and claim they bribed you or something mm. I don't know, I just wish I knew more. I'm gonna see if I can talk to the old lady first. And she was see what she ha what she has to say. Also, maybe I will also get the option to give it to her anyway. Not that I will, but I'm just gonna see if I can actually talk to her. Snitch on them. <laughs> I'm usually not a snitch, but you know, it's just this whole world is kind of... It's kind of fragile, you know? It would feel very wrong to just let that happen. Sell the info and then sell the things, then make them pay to get the things back. <laughs> oh. 
The old lady isn't here. Excuse me, but these things washed up on the shore, and... Good gravy, this is illegal. All of this is illegal. Where did you get this? Well, that's a long story. Huh. The old broad finally slipped up. Hmm. Then you're familiar with her little import-export business? Oh, we've been watching her for years. There's a huge bounty on her head in the next continent. Oh, okay, so we did do the right thing. Good. We always suspected it was her, but never had proof she was really the perpetrator. But now we got more than enough evidence to put her away. You've done a fine deed this day, citizen. We did a good thing! Se see what I mean? Several days later? This is why I can't plant things. Hello again. Thanks, for your Thanks to your information. The old woman is behind bars. And she's gonna rot there. Oh, damn. Oh. Well, I guess that's good news. Sure is. We've been chasing her forever. Oh, and I also received word to arrange, uh, arrange your reward. He's waiting for you at the post office. Hmm. At the post office. Don't mind if I do. No, that's the wrong way. This is the K9, K10 unit for your boss up. <laughs> uh, Vepric police. I did a good. I did a good. Hey there. Hey there. I mean, you're quite the bounty hunter to have caught that slippery eel of a woman. It was more luck than anything. It takes more than luck to catch someone like that. Anyway, hang on. Got your reward right. Yeah, here it is. 50,000 gold? That's like twice as much as I already had, and I haven't even spent the money on anything. Holy shit. That's a lot of gold. Damn. That's a lot of money. That's what I'm saying. And this is just your share. That woman must have been among uh, among the world's most wanted criminals. The quest the scattered cargo is complete. Damn! I'm rich! Yeah, getting that loot. Getting that booty. Um... Turn her in. Do you want to know what happened if you didn't turn her in? Sure. Sure. Would I get an achievement? <laughs> uh, I think this is where I'm gonna gonna end, though. End, end the game for today. I've also used up all my snoozes. You check to make sure it wouldn't get into- yeah, I mean, I- I know. I'm just- I'm just- <laughs> I'm just joking. I know you checked specifically for that. Dude, I just need to double check that I actually saved. I get very paranoid when it comes to saving. I would have gotten t 20k golden discount in the store. Oh! I wonder what the store would have sold, though. Probably nothing too interesting. But 20k? Mm, not that that much in comparison. Mm, let's see. Let's see. Mm-mm. You go to bed, go get some sleep. You don't know how good the discount would have been. Pots mostly. Mm. Yeah. I'm glad I did what I did. I'm glad I, I, I seem to have made the right choice. 20k is not 50k, it just as prevails. Yeah. 
We did a good thing. I feel like this has been a good, good sesh. And we became hot as well. Damn. Was not expecting that, I have to say. <laughs> was, was not expecting that, but you know, I'm not complaining. Uh, let's see, let's see. Made real progress, yeah. Real progress. Next time, which will be on Wednesday, next time we're gonna, we're gonna continue and we're gonna continue in the main quest. So we're gonna talk to Emil, see if we can find a way to, uh, cure Kaina of her petrification as well. That was the biggest win of the session, let's be real. You have no idea how warm I was talking about that, because... <laughs> I was like, I was holding in everything that I wanted to say. And still managed to say... Uh, a lot, is, is what I'm... Saying now. <laughs> we became hot? You already got... Well, I'm not saying you. I mean, I just meant me in the game. But have a good night, ghost. Thank you so much for being here. Hope you sleep well. And have a good rest of your, your Saturday on, and weekend. Because <laughs> you're being a weapon. <laughs> uh, but it's gonna it's gonna be fun though. I, I can't wait to play this again on Wednesday. I am I'm really enjoying this. I I would actually keep playing if it wasn't for the fact that I Well It's like 2 a.m. And I also just need to unwind a little bit. I've been so tired today. If I wasn't so tired, I would probably have streamed for like another hour, maybe. <laughs> yeah, it was, uh, it was a good sesh. That was a good sesh. I can't wait to, to blah, 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 play more. Um, I opened up the wrong window. Um, have a heckin' awesome Sunday, you too, Craig, and everyone else. You deserve it. You deserve it. Uh, so who are we gonna we gonna raid today? Who are we gonna raid today? Let's see. Hmm. Well. We can raid Toonie. Toonie's playing Resident Evil. Resident Evil 1 on the GameCube. So he's, he's doing some retro gaming today, it seems. Yeah, let us do that. Let's raid uh, Toonie. I haven't been able to raid him in a while. He's usually been the one to raid me. So, let's do that. Let's do that. It's been fun hanging out as always. You're the best. No, you're the best. He's petting z zombies? Um, uh, something like that, yeah. GameCube is retro. It, it is. It is. <laughs> I think technically PlayStation 3 is considered retro now, which is insane to me. So, that's... That's uh, even worse. Even worse. But yeah, let us let us read Toonie. So please. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey. It do be like that. It do be like that. We we. Well, let's just pretend it's not like that though. But yeah, if you if you're subbed, you can copy the first raid message. If you're not subbed, you can copy the second one. Um, I hope you want to join in for the raid, and I will see you again on Wednesday, where we're going to continue playing uh, near replicants. And then on Thursday, we do have Dawn to Dawn in Discord or Dawn to Day, as we call it. And we our little group grows every week now, so it's really nice. And if you want to catch up. And join us 
by Thursday if you haven't watched anything. It is on Netflix. So you have three episodes to catch up on. Uh, and then we're going to watch the fourth one on Thursday. So I highly recommend it. It's a good time. It's a good time. But yeah. Here's the Discord. But yeah. I hope you have a good rest of your weekend, guys. Thank you for being here. Thank you for, for hanging out. Having some good talks. And, you know, just, just being you. Because you're amazing. All you amazing. Yeah. See you. Bye. Bye.